Ah, phone, you ruined the ambiance. <laughs> oh, damn it. You should have turned that down. Oh. Well, you know. Wouldn't be a lemon stream if it wasn't goofed. Hello. Good morning. I think a few people are on the commercial, so we're going to give them a minute. <laughs> We're gonna give them a minute. Those of you that didn't have to pay for a commercial, um, you guys got to see that little moment there, so just just enjoy that. <laughs> oh, goodness gracious. Only six second ad? Oh, okay, good. That's not bad. I always worry about what YouTube's gonna do. All right. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, whatever time it is for you. Hope you're all doing well. Today, ladies and gentlemen, we are doing what it says on the screen. We are basically playing Boss Weapon Gun Game. Um, this isn't the official gun game mod. This isn't the one where, like, you know, you do a certain amount of damage and then suddenly you get a new weapon. We're not doing that. Um, basically, what we're looking for is we're going to run in. You know, I'll just show you. Be better to just do it itself. Also, if the music is too loud, let me know. Um, just because I have a... I readjusted things from the last stream, hoping to make it all work out, and I'm hoping it worked, but you just have to let me know. So, music is fine? Good. Dave the Mage, re-upping, my man. Good morning, drowning citrus fruit. <laughs> or submerged lemon, whatever. <laughs> I'll take either. Either is fine. Hope you're doing well. Thank you so much for jumping back in. Sure, why not? Also, jumping back in for three months. Dave for four. Welcome back, you guys. There's music. <laughs> Sometimes. Oh, gosh. All right. So, uh, basically, this is not a new mod. This is just me doing the thing. Um, the way we're going to do this is I have selected a character. Um, basically, what we're going to do is I will get the first weapon, which is the longsword, and I will be allowed to use it just because no one wants to see me punch the asylum demon to death. But after I kill a boss, if that boss has an associated weapon or drop, I will automatically make it happen and transform my current weapon into it. So, for example, and I kill the Asylum Demon with my longsword, it will turn my sword into the Demon's Great Hammer. And uh, I will not be adjusting my stats. So that is going to be the trick of the run. Demon King, thank you so much. Really appreciate that donation. And the cute little lemon emote. <laughs> Is that Carl in the background? That looks like Carl. We'll call it Carl. An ice ball. Welcome. Enjoy your new emotes. And if you go to the community tab on my channel, you will also see from members only some wallpapers. Enjoy those as well. Get out of my way. There we go. Punch the boss to death. No, no. Look. We could do it, right? Like, we've proven in a couple of videos that I can do it, and everyone knows that you can do it. It's not, like, that surprising. Um, would you rather watch me punch a, de a boss to death for 10 minutes, or would you rather see where this run could possibly go? And get an extra 10 minutes of content. Just saying. Is it like a move swap or weapon swap? Weapon swap. It, were, uh, it changes the weapon, not the move. Well, I guess it changes the weapon to that. You'll see. You'll see. I've fisted enough big booty bopping enough for a lifetime? Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> I've had my time. I'm done. No, we're not punching. <laughs> you guys. All right, fine. Fine. You want punches? There. Are you happy, chat? <laughs> Are you happy? You did this. Uh, anyway. Let's go. Long sword it is. Blasphemy. <laughs> Just be glad I'm not going to kill Solaire. Probably. Oscar, no! <laughs> uh, punch Man. <laughs> I appreciate the donation. We're not doing Punch Man, sorry. We're not doing it. Jonathan, thank you so much. <laughs> Look at that little guy. Aw, Lemon and Carl having a good time there. Yeah, get gets guy out of here. Alright. Let's get this party started, shall we? Music feels, uh, music feels appropriate. <laughs> Potato death over there. Woohoo! Half damage, not bad. 
give Chad what they want? I did. <laughs> we just started Lemon. <laughs> the murdered ratings are already off the charts. Why does my music have talking in it? No, who did this? YouTube. That's because the room All right. everything in it are only active when Mario's in the Shush. No one cares. All right, there we go. Sorry, had to had to fix that. <laughs> oh, I'll have to take that one off the playlist. Dang it. All right, so there we go. So that's that. Now, let me quickly switch over to my mod. We've got the long sword. And now this works out properly. Demon's great hammer. There it is. Replace. And if all goes well, there it is. It is now a great hammer. I think I have to unequip this real quick. There we are. Woohoo! All right, we've got it. Look how good it is. Yeah, it's so good. <laughs> oh god. Oh, this is going to be bad. Uh, let's take off all our armor, too. So at least I'm not running at slow speed. What are we looking at? Eh, medium roll. Medium roll is fine. Can't use it? I know. And that is the struggle. <laughs> I had to learn about bird eye view from 60 Mario 64. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> oh, gosh. Alrighty. Let's get this party going, huh? Probably does 30 damage. Oh man, it does 30 damage if we're lucky. I'm guessing it does less than that. Now, here's the thing that I couldn't really explain because uh, YouTube is doesn't allow for a lot of room. Um, I am, for the sake of argument, I am going to allow invaders to count as mini bosses as well because they're, uh, you know, they're also kind of enemies with health bars. So any mini boss invader or boss that I kill, I'll get their weapon. We won't be using that too often, but I figured you guys might want to see me use like the Black Knight Halberd or something like that occasion, like once, so we'll see. Is this an all bosses run? We're certainly gonna try. We're certainly gonna try. But right now I need a few souls real quick. I promise this will not turn into me just like watching enemies fall off a cliff uh, just so I have enough strength for this weapon because uh, I have another idea. So give it a minute. Do the Virgil build. <laughs> Alright, let's see here. So basically, if it hits harder than a howitzer, you get its weapon for defeating it. Um, maybe not that loose of a definition, but close. Lesser Taurus has one. Lesser Taurus. Oh, that's true, yeah. Yeah, yeah. The next few bosses all have heavy weapons? I know. <laughs> That's the trick, isn't it? But we're working on it. All right, let's see. How many souls do I need? Oh, perfect. All right, we're done. We're done. Let me just grab this. What's my gift? My gift is the... Uh, it is the Master Cape. Because we're going to be needing to do... We're going to be needing to do a lot of sequence breaking in order to make this work best. All right. Do boss soul weapons count? They do. Yes. So, for example, if I were to kill Quelog, um, I can now transform my weapon into either Quelog's Fury Sword or the Chaos Blade. What about crafted boss weapons? Same deal. Yep. Those count. All the upcoming weapons have absurd strength requirements. Uh, well, you'll see. You'll see. Will I get the sword you get from Nito? Yeah, so for Nito, I know technically you don't actually get anything from him, but his Gravelord sword is basically in his hand, so we're going to count that. If you can use the weapon in question, we'll allow it. Alright. So, where's he going? What's he doing? Who knows? What's this challenge about? This challenge is about breaking the sequence and trying out all the boss weapons against other bosses. More or less. What about the butterfly shield? That's, and that's a little tricky. Because when it comes to some bosses, I'm not sure how to do this just yet. But some bosses allow you to have two weapons to choose from. And I know which ones I'd prefer, but like, you know, like I'd much prefer the spear to the shield. Um, 
But maybe for those ones to make things interesting, maybe what we'll do is we'll uh, we'll let chat decide. That way, you, we'll we'll start like a little poll in chat, and you guys can decide whether or not to. Uh, <laughs> if you guys want me to suffer, or if you want me to keep going. Let chat decide. Yeah, all right, we'll do it. Or flip a coin. We could do that too. Oh man, the lag is really bad. The lag is really bad today. YouTube does not like it when I am both streaming and also streaming music. I've noticed. Remarso, thank you so much. Appreciate you joining. Spartan kick everything. <laughs> well, we are going to Spartan kick one thing. Just one. Blight Town, no weapons? No, no, no. We got a weapon. Give it a minute. <laughs> the 60 FPS fix is working? I know, right? Letting chat decide won't end badly for sure. Oh yeah, no, I trust them. They're gonna be, we're gonna be just fine. <laughs> Demon King's, see, Demon King suggested. He knows. They know. All right. Kill Ornstein and Smo. Will you get Smo's weapon or Ornstein's? Again, that'll be a chat decision. Which now I'm thinking about it, that could end really badly for me. Maybe it won't. <laughs> maybe we won't do that. I don't know. Because <laughs> if I don't, if I don't have the right stats for things, it's gonna be real bad real quick. All right. We got one chance at this. Oh, no, we've got four chances. How smart. Let's do this. <laughs> You're crazy. I'll give that to you. <laughs> if you didn't know I was crazy, you haven't been watching. Do music in Blight Town. Fitting. Yeah, feels right, doesn't it? Did I try the Sultan Sanctuary beta patch? I have not had the time, although I have been talking to Zephyr the entire time. He's a... Uh, He's come to me a few times asking me, like, for suggestions or, like, my opinion on certain balance changes. Ah, uh, poison, that's good. We like poison. Uh, so I'm well aware of what it, uh, what it all entails. It looks like a good time. He did a lot of really great fixes, like, fixing all the, a lot of glitches. Um, I know the speedrun community is a little upset, uh, due to, like, things like long jump and stuff being taken out. But, uh, in the future... It'll be like an optional patch. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to reveal that or not, but it's, it's all going to be like... It'll be like any other Steam update where you can roll it back um, just by going to properties and then like clicking on a uh, which patch you want to use. So if you really, really need long jump to enjoy yourself... Oh, God, I didn't mean to swing. Oh, God. A fine start. <laughs> Great. Thank you. All right. Good. Good. That's good. <laughs> Oh, a bot. Oh, good. They're, they, they've come up with new ideas, have they? Let's see if we can't fix that. Yeah, here. Shoot. Right, there we go. Problem solved. Problem solved. Right. Is Sultan Sacrifice going to be on the Switch? I have no idea. If I had to guess, I'd say yes. Um, just because they were on pretty much everything when Sultan Sanctuary came out. Bunny Wild. I have half a day off and still have to be up early to call into a meeting. Oh, I hate when that happens. <laughs> At least there's backlogs to listen to. There you go. Some little background music for you while you're pretending to listen. <laughs> uh, you hope the bot steps on a Lego? Jeez, man. Take it easy. <laughs> God Emperor Kirby. Are you aware that you have perished? I am aware. <laughs> I have been told. Uh, again with the poison, man. That guy is just in the wrong position. All right, Mildred. Second time's a charm. Boss weapons only, pretty much. There'll be a couple. Uh, there'll be a couple like invader weapons and other things they'll be using, but for the most part, it'll be big enemy only weapons. Yeah. You're not making that many videos on Sultan Sacrifice, it seems. Well, to be fair, it's a very long game, and uh, it's a little tricky to decide how I want to format the video. Um, but yes, I agree. Uh, this month got really hectic for me. I had a lot of, what are you doing? Um, I had so many IRL things to deal with every weekend. Like, every single one of my weekends this month was taken up by something. So I had to decide on making content I knew I could pump out quick. Um, or nothing at all. Alright. Kick! No! Stop swinging! Oh my god. I need you. <laughs> now she's taunting us. All right, hold on. Can you... Can I not... Can I not kick with this in my hands? Oh, God, she's free. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. Hands off. Ow. All right. Let's, let's reset. 
Let's reset. Come here. There you go. There you go. Later. I've still got it equipped. It's still <laughs> it's still weighing me down. <laughs> oh god. Yeah, I broken. Yeah, clearly. Let's see. Why? Okay. There's the kick. All right. Maybe I'm just bad. Maybe I'm just bad. Get. Oh god. No. Get. Get. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! <laughs> oh my god. Man. You know, that's, um, that is unfortunate. Um, <laughs> I swear I tested this last night and it worked just fine. Oh no. That's good. That's good. Oh well. Gamers Weekend collab. I believe Gamers Weekend is an extremely busy man. I don't think, uh, I don't think that'll ever happen. Unfortunately, the run is going well so far. Yeah, no, no, it's going great. Uh, <laughs> Wannabe, love seeing the videos over and over again from time to time. None of them ever managed to bore you. Keep up the good work, and thank you for all the enjoyment. Well, I appreciate that. Thank you so much for saying so. And thank you so much for the donation. Really appreciate that as well. Oh, that reminds me, uh, the, re <laughs> the reason we're here, uh, not only to suffer and have a good old time. Wait, okay, let me just get a few practice knees in here. There we go. All right, I've got it. I'm ready. Um, first task and you failed again. <laughs> yeah, I know, I know. Give me a minute, I'm working on it, I'm working on it. <laughs> oh, God. Um, yeah, the reason we're here, just in case anyone forgot, the, uh... God damn it, Tony t-shirts. We have one more day. I think by the end of today, in like about, mm, give or take, about 16 hours, uh, they will be gone. I don't know if they'll be gone forever, but they'll definitely be gone for an extended period of time. So if you had any interest in getting that t-shirt, uh, get on it. <laughs> but it helps me out, helps the channel out. You get a cool shirt out of it as well. All right, get, all right, well. Okay, there we go. Progress. She took damage. <laughs> now we just need to do that about five more times. What's she doing? I don't know. She's having a she's having a day. Maybe it'd be easier if I just didn't lock on to her. That seems to be goofing things up as well. Come on up. Hey, how's it going? No. That did not make things easier. That made things far worse. Okay. <laughs> <sighs> I've changed my mind. You were a bad idea. Oh my god, every time. <laughs> I mean, at least she's doing my job for me, but jeez. <laughs> Why am I struggling so hard? This is so bad. Uh, later, Demon King. Joy class. Have a good time. Go learn something good. Do I have any pets? Yes, several. Oh my god, every time. <laughs> it's working. I don't, whatever, I can't complain. It's working. As long as we have enough S's to make it through this, we'll be okay. The hammer is better than the goofy axe? You mean like the golf axe? Is that what the one you're talking about? We'll see. Can ask her nicely to jump on her own. You know, she I haven't even had to ask. She's just kind of doing it. Uh, there we go. You dead yet? Yeah! There we go. <laughs> Alright. And the nice thing about this one, I don't even have to spawn it in. It's right there. Yoink! Alright, let's get the hell out of here. Uh. Run away! <laughs> if it's working, that's good, but not working good. <laughs> it's the best worst plan I had, alright? What a fight to behold, yeah. <laughs> Lemon, gets hit six Lemon gets hit six times, and then the enemy just commits Sudoku over there. Alright, a couple more points. Oh, wow. Wow, that's a lot of... Really? Did she drop that much souls? Oh my god, I didn't realize that would be that good. Okay, great. That's really helpful. Cool. Alright. Ba-ding, ba-boom. We've got our new weapon. Butcher knife. Can even one-hand it. So, next, let's go. Now don't die. <laughs> no, no, it's okay. We're not playing that kind of gun game. It's not where if I die, I have to uh, go back a level. Is the butcher sword good? Probably not. Probably not, but I'm sure it's better than, uh, I can use it, so it's better than what I was using. Wouldn't mind seeing me take on Payday VR? 
Oh, that's the that's the uh, heist game, right? Well, if you guys can find a VR company to sponsor the channel and give me a free VR headset, I'll I'll play any VR you want. I'd love to try Minecraft in VR. If I'm being completely honest, um, I you know I already like to do like building things with my hands. So if I can, the closer I can get to that, the better. <laughs> my teacher can wait some minutes. I can't lose lemon killing something. Ah, well, I mean, agree to disagree. I've I've seen tuition prices, but hey, you you do you. <laughs> All right, let's go. How do you get past the Inner Londo archers? Um, with determination and a lot of crying. How's this sort of boss weapon? Well, it, we're also counting mini bosses and invaders. So, if you kill an invader or if you kill a mini boss, then some basically if you kill something that does not respawn, you get its weapon. That probably would have been a better way to uh, to phrase it. So, my apologies. All right, you. Yeah, I'm here. Let's see what we're looking at. Ooh, that's bad damage. <laughs> but, on the plus side, it does give us a little health back when we get a hit. So there's something. We can stave off death by poison. Alright. As long as I don't die to lag, oh god. As long as we don't die to lag, we'll be okay. Yeah. So far, so good. There we go. Doing okay. That was a bad time to heal. Yeah. Worked out. <laughs> Wannabe, thank you so much for joining. I appreciate you. Enjoy those emotes and wallpapers. Are resins allowed? Yeah, resins allowed. If I have the foresight to actually collect some, then, uh, yeah, absolutely. Basically, this entire run is kind of just here to, uh, showcase a lot of the boss weapons that people either don't see or just don't get around to using. Ooh. Let's get away from all the pool, huh? It's not that hot of a day today. You can get away from the pool today. There we go. It's not so bad. Now, the trick of it, of course, is going to be that I probably won't be upgrading anything because things will switch over to new weapons pretty quick. So it'd be kind of useless for me to grind out stuff. What's the best build for a normal playthrough? Oh, that depends. If you're struggling with melee combat, then a mage is definitely a good time for you. Because um, it's really strong. Um, if you like the melee combat and are okay with, like, you know, picking up a shield and doing your thing. Ooh. Um... I recommend what what excuse me hello <laughs> what, what was that <laughs> I was within 20 feet of a puddle therefore I took damage what the hell um, but yeah if you uh, if you're not like a ranged warrior I would recommend probably something with a 100% shield just to kind of get used to things and then um, I personally like having some healing spells under my belt like a paladin build essentially uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Alright, good. That, that music was not appropriate. I was about to cry. Um, ow, God. Wait, like, can you, like, just be cool? Just be cool. Honey. You make me sad. Oh, God. Come on. Alright, we're safe. We're safe. Magic pixel. We're fine. Almost there. Uh, yeah, I always go with a Paladin build my first time through a game. Uh, just because you can kind of do some big damage, but also get plenty of heals in. A tank, if you will. Alright. Gotta focus, gotta focus. Come on. There you go. I'm okay with the lava attacks. That means I get more chances to hit. Almost there, though. Magic Pixel's the weapon. <laughs> I don't even want to know. I don't even want to know what that would look like. Oh, the lag. Come on, baby. Pull together. I know it's Blight Town. You can do it. I'm 
close there. Oh god. Don't, don't, don't goof on me now, come on. I'm just, I'm just not gonna even trust that. Here. Let's get out of here. So is bass Dark Souls music copyrighted or do you just prefer you have your own stuff playing? Uh, well, honestly, when it comes to these kind of streams, um, Dark Souls music only plays when you're playing boss music. Oh, that was really close. Ah, right, yeah, I hear you. Um, because the music only plays during, you know, during bosses, I prefer to just kind of, uh, have my own stuff going. I, fe I feel like it's more fun for everybody. All right. That's a good number of souls right there. What boss weapon is this? Uh, well, we're actually about to decide. It's gonna change. The music in the background is just perfect. Glad you like Conker's Bad Fur Day. <laughs> this is an old game from the N64, which no one was allowed to play because it was rated M. Which is why I had my grandmother get it for me. <laughs> what is this song? This is called, I think, the, it's like the windmill or something like that from Conker's Bad Fur Day. Alright, so first things first. Let's get the hell out of this hellhole. Wait, no, I have places to go. Nope, I have I have a plan. I have a plan. I gotta stick to the plan. Uh, Alright, everybody. I think we're gonna allow it. I think, considering how many souls I've been getting, we're gonna allow it. Uh, are we, A, going to... I'm gonna push her out of the way. We're not taking the homeward bone. We'll be fine. Are we, A, allowing a pull? Uh, yeah, yeah, whatever you say. Um, are we allowing a pull for this weapon upcoming, or are we doing it just where I can just pick one? I, I, I don't even know why I ask. I know exactly what you guys are going to say. Coin flip? <laughs> Seeing a lot of pulls. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so in that case... Alright, 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 alright. <laughs> you got it, you got it, you got it, you got it. You got it. Let me see what I can do here. I think I need to... Do I need to switch my... Oh, hold on a minute. I am the wrong... <laughs> I am the wrong... Uh, I am signed in at the wrong account. Pause the music for a minute. Time out. Need to switch accounts here. Yes, yes. Thank you, music. <laughs> All right, give me one second. This is going to get a little wonky. Just going to get a little wonky. Just gonna get... All right. Okay, create a poll. Uh, let's see. We're, we either have a choice of Chaos Blade or Fury Sword. This is going to be Chaos Blade. This one's going to be Fury Sword. Go. All right. The poll has been started, ladies and gentlemen. I'll give you about one minute, about one minute to start putting in your votes. But during that time, let's get the music going again here, huh? Uh, let's try some new music. What else you got? Oh, good. More Conker's Bed for a Day. All right, cool. We'll take it. Um, yes. So, again... <laughs> pull rigged. <laughs> you say that, but I'm looking at the, the results right now, and it's it's pretty close. It's pretty close. Uh, but yeah, go ahead and vote which one we're taking. I think we have enough souls to make either of them work, so that won't be a problem. Uh, it's just a matter of which one. I don't think of, I guess which one you actually want to see. Um, you know, I imagine a lot of people have seen the Fury Sword, so some people might not know what the Chaos Blade even does. But do uh, you do you? But anyway. Uh, and again, just a reminder, t-shirts are available for a limited time only, probably a little less than 16 hours now at this point. So if you haven't gotten that, go ahead. Pop in and grab that if you if you mean to. And if not, if you don't have the funds or you're just not interested in the shirt, don't worry about it. As long as you're here, I'm happy. In all honesty, we'll be coming up with some more merch later on down the line, probably a few months from now, as long as I get good feedback on the current shirts as far as their uh, quality goes. Um, as long as people like the quality, then we'll make some more stuff. So, and if not, I'll have to, you know, shop around and find a new company, blah, blah, blah. Blah, 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 business antics, don't worry about it. 
All right. I'm thinking. About another 20 seconds. Do I play Pokemon? I used to. I grew up on it. I remember when it first came to the United States. It was crazy. Stop saying dual wield you other rings. <laughs> Technically, dual wielding was also in Dark Souls 3 and Dark Souls 2. It's okay. But yes, there's no dual wielding in uh there's no dual wielding in Dark Souls 1. Sorry. Yes, Chaos Blade is the self-damage katana. Fury Sword is what Quaylag just had, that fire sword. <laughs> the shirts are fire. <laughs> if you think these are fire, you should see the upcoming designs we've got going on. All right, that's good enough. That'll do. The votes are in. The poll has ended. You could put a weapon in your offhand. <laughs> you can, but then what do you do? And the answer is, we're using the Chaos Blade. You animals. <laughs> you absolute animals. All right. I'm going to pause that one there. Hopefully we don't need the... I'll tell you what, I'm going to copy that link. That way I don't need to look at it or keep it running. Okay, and for all of you that were uh, that are buying merch in the current time, thank you so much. I appreciate you. <laughs> Alrighty, so let me do a quick. Let me do some quick nonsense here. We take this butcher blade of ours. I think. Let me make sure I do it right. Go in here. Go to the butcher knife. All right, and then we change this to the Chaos Blade, not Chaos Dagger, that's not it. Yes, the Uchi Katana, that's the one. Oh, no it's not. Is it, it is called just a Chaos Blade, right? I'm not crazy. Hmm. That's not good. <laughs> why, why, we gotta find it. Uh, you know, it wouldn't. It doesn't help that the <laughs> chaos, chaos is a type in this. The mod itself is like, did you mean like, do you want like a Nuchi Katana with chaos on it? No, I don't want that. I want it. I want an actual chaos blade. Oh boy. Uh, now I gotta find it. Is it something? Is it called something else? The Makoto. <laughs> yeah, it's not called the Makoto in this. And that's Demon Souls. Ah, oh, dang it. Hold on. Hold on. Gotta weed through all these weapons here. It's gonna take a minute. This mod was not meant for that. Ugh. Well, anyway, Chad, how are you guys doing? <laughs> How's everyone doing today? Parrying dagger? No. Oh God. All right. Maybe that. Maybe it's organized by. I think it might be organized by weapon type. So I just gotta find the. Uh... Yeah, because there's watching pole after Uchi. Hopefully. The boss weapons or not. Yato. There it is, Chaos Blade. Wait, no. <laughs> nope, that's not it. Dang it. That was close. And that's Mail Breakers, so that's not it. And there's the Murakumo. Chaos Server. No. I think we're diving the wrong way here. There's Fury Sword. Oh, oh, I see what it's doing. Okay, no, 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 I get it. All right, we're good, we're good. Sorry, that took me a minute. Yes, go ahead and make that. All right, let's see if that worked. Yeah, that's it. All right, cool, we're good. I see what it was doing. It was asking me what weapon I wanted to use as the base, and that's, that's silly, it didn't matter. Okay, so let's see what this thing is. It is the soul of Quelag, blah, blah, blah. This blade inherits the, only the chaotic nature of Quelag and it has a unique spec design. Blade wielder erodes along with opponents. Is this one that constantly hurts me? Or is it whenever I swing? It appears to be whenever I connect with an opponent. Okay, so whenever I hit something is when I hit. Well, that's way better than Demon Souls. Demon Souls, it would literally... <laughs> Every second it would take you down a down a peg. All right, what do I need? 14 dexterity? Sure. No problem. There's that. 
Um, and I think in the future I will need at least 18, so we'll take that. We'll dump into that. Man, Conquer's Bad Friday's getting full representation today. And we're just gonna pop this. There we go. Don't hit the NPCs. I'm trying, I'm trying. Pump a little bit more to that. That way when chat sabotages me, we'll be okay. Alright, everybody. See you later. Next up, we got Ceaseless. Now, Ceaseless doesn't drop anything and doesn't have any weapons, so he's basically just free souls, which is helpful. Uh, but it'll also be a good test for the Chaos Blade, so that'll be good. Shivering in bed right now. Where are you there? It's cold. <laughs> How do I get there? So much good music from a game that nobody played on release. I know! I know. Great game, though. Absolute great game. The Xbox version was uh, a little disappointing. The graphics were great, and the multiplayer was a lot of fun. But um, they took out most of my favorite multiplayer modes, which really disappointed me. Playing Raptors. Oh, so good. Raptors or uh, Frenchies. Frenchies was a good one. Oh, I love that. Brazil is cold? Oh. All right. Guess we're going to Brazil. Where's the music from? It, this is uh, this is the uh, the heist mode in Conqueror's Bad Fur Day multiplayer, where you basically tried to rob each other in a bank, in a giant vault. <laughs> they also censored it more. They did, but they also added a toggle, so you could turn off the censors, which was uh, an immediate flick, <laughs> considering I was significantly older when the remastered version, or er, remastered, when the new version, when Reloaded came out. Sounds, that sounds like a hilarious game mode. Oh, you have no idea. Maybe one of these days I'll, I'll try and get my little brother to play with me. I'll, if I can get, if I can emulate it and get me and my little brother playing on a, like Parsec or something, then maybe we can make it work. No cheese, no cheese, no cheese. All right, I tell you what, we'll we'll give it one good try of no cheese. We'll give it some no cheese tries. Go on, do your little burst. There you go. Yeah, let's move. I was about to say, come to Brazil! <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy, that health drain. <laughs> that's that's not good, guys. This might not be doable without with the cheese. Woo! Definitely not doable with the cheese. Alright! <laughs> Damn it. They censored the Great Mighty Pooh? I don't even remember that. I mean, I remember the, the Great Mighty Pooh. I didn't remember them censoring it. I must have flicked it too fast. All right, well, back at it. <laughs> Don't worry, we still have to use the Chaos Blade on other bosses. We'll have to use it on another boss. <laughs> this boss is truly the peak of his genius. Uh, <laughs> it's, it's certainly a great representation of how much he hates his players. Actually, no, I take that back. No, that, there's plenty of other bosses that emanate that better. Now, this is a... This is an interesting boss for the sake of, like, story, I'd say. You know, just kind of interesting. Now, of course, at this point, now I have to sprint like a madman. Just to not get, like, one shot in a corner forever. Come on, run. Run faster. I told you to run faster. <laughs> I warned you. Alright, so now, because the cheese is broken, unless... I need to go all the way over here. Oh, God! Unending relief of load. <laughs> There's uh that's one translation. Top off here. Here he comes. Oh god. We need to get back there. <laughs> Otherwise this isn't gonna work. Oh uh, I stole your sister's clothes! <laughs> yeah, pretty much exactly what's going on here. Hmm. Am I like slow rolling? No. Okay, so I'm just bad. All right, that's fine. I can I can live with that fact. All right. <laughs> Never stop release. <laughs> is the cheese broken? No, the cheese isn't broken. Basically, what happens is if you don't walk all the way back to where the armor was. Yeah, you're right. Full health or death. Um, if you don't run all the way back to where the armor was, then you won't 
he won't ever do the jump. Like, the only way to trigger that, uh, that jump is for him to think that you've stolen the armor again. So, that is, that is the trick. Okay, good. I thought he was about to, thought he was about to ceaseless discharge on me again. Wow, okay, one hit kill. That's cool. <laughs> Using no armor for extra challenge. I tend to run everywhere naked anyway, just to uh, make sure that I have the uh, fastest roll and run speed. Um, mostly because I like to get as much content as possible, and also just because I'm so used to playing the game now that I don't like to go slow. Gotta go fast. <laughs> block? Yeah, sure, let me just block with this katana. <laughs> Let me just block with this thing. Giant arm swings at you. I've got this. Wait, this isn't an anime. Oh no! My channel is light. Oh no! <laughs> nah, I got, I got what you were saying. Chaos block. Yeah, right. <laughs> Sekiro approved. Yeah, true, true. <laughs> My favorite Soulsborne game. Depends on what I'm after. If I want lore, Dark Souls 1. If I want PvP, Dark Souls 2. If I want uh, mechanics, Dark Souls 3. And uh, if I want... Oh god, he's gonna do it anyway. Alright, Chaos Block! <laughs> Alright, I'm a level 1 anime character. I forgot. Um, and, uh... What else? Would you please just let me get to the back? I just wanna go! Come on, just parry him. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I'd say those three. I, I guess I really do like Bloodborne, but I have to be in the mood. Um, I have to be in the mood for some Lovecraftian uh, content before I uh, before I enjoy Bloodborne. Sekiro just isn't for me. I'm I'm too bad at the timing. I feel like I'm just I just do this constantly, and I I want to pretend that there's a better way to do it, but if there is, I can't seem to get it. Uh, and then Elder Ring. I don't like Elder Ring. <laughs> Say hello to Pain. Hi, Pain. Yeah, we're we're definitely uh, we're definitely in Pain Town. All because Chat wanted me to not cheese, and now all of a sudden Chat's like, "No, wait, this is better. Go ahead and cheese. <laughs> Go ahead and cheese. It's causing you to suffer." Don't do it. I swear, I can usually. There we go. God. I was gonna say, I know I can normally get there. I don't know why I can't get there lately. Dark Souls 2 opinion? It's a good game. It's definitely got some questionable things about it. I don't blame anybody that doesn't like it. Um, it's a bit floaty as well. That would be my argument. Did he pull it out? All right, we're good. He rips out that large arm of his, and that's how you know you're good to go. Um... Yeah, it's a bit floaty for my taste. I'll agree with that. Like, that feels weird. And I know it's more of a I hit, now you hit kind of combat. Which is similar to Dark Souls 1, but maybe a little bit more so. Um, and I do wish they didn't do... Whoa! Um, I do wish they didn't do anything to do with uh, that evasion crap, the adaptability. It was an interesting idea, but they probably shouldn't have done it. That said, though, uh, the rest of it, I like it. Dave the Mage! Ah, yes. Easy souls from Ceaseless. I am seeing that happen on screen. Hopefully. Also, I, I see the ch I see the bot. Give me a minute. Come on. There you go. Alright. One, two, three. Give you a minute to think about what you've done. Four, five, six, and seven. Adios. Goodbye, my friend. All right. Dark Souls 2 is bad. Scholar of the First Sin is great. Well, considering they stopped selling the first one and it's only Scholar of the First Sin now, that's kind of what I mean. All right. That wasn't so bad. Let's get rid of that bot there. Uh, hide user. There we go. Moving on. Woo. All right. Got our souls. Let's go spend them. And then we have to use this weapon on an actual boss. Hooray! <laughs> Imagine having 99 resistance, adaptability, and luck. <laughs> well, honestly, 
you'd probably be better off than you think. Uh, I know everyone says, like, don't put points into resistance, and they're right, because, you know, like, resistance can just be quote-unquote bought with, uh, with armor types. So if you've got an armor that fits the occasion, like, why did you put points into resistance, you know? But, that said, putting points into resistance means Blight Town is a lot easier. Adaptability, of course, we all know why that would be a good thing, and then, yeah. Alright, more strength. Strength, good. Me like strength. Okay. I think if we get one more strength, if we get one more strength, um, we should be good to go as far as all the heavy weapons are concerned, which is great. Luck is an amazing stat. Oh my god, I know. Luck is- no. No- <laughs> no bullshitting. Luck is my favorite stat to pour into once my build is done, or if a game has luck weapons, like luck scaling weapons. Like my first run through of Salt and, Sanct uh, Salt and Sacrifice, Salt 2, uh, I did a luck build. Which was great, because it meant not only did I- my crossbow do like huge amounts of damage, but it also meant that I didn't have to grind as much, which was awesome. Why no like Elden Ring? It bad. No. Um, <laughs> thank you so much for the donation. I'll explain in a minute. And for someone that's like, oh no, Elden Ring is great for co-op. Uh, now it is. Thanks to the community. It isn't if you're just playing base. Because uh, FromSoft kind of goofed that one a bit, if I'm being honest. Um, I don't like Elden Ring because it's too big. It feels noisy. Like there's just too much going on. And I feel directionless when I play it. Um, it also feels like it wants me to commit a hundred plus hours into a single playthrough, uh, which I do not have the time for as a working class adult. Um, I just simply, and with a family, you know, I just don't have that kind of time commitment. So it's, uh, just not a good fit for me. Um, combine that with the fact that all of the weapons just don't feel right in my hands. Uh, that the, I couldn't play co-op with my wife because the co-op was so bad when we tried to play it, or when we were interested in playing it, I should say. Um, and friends, my wife and friends. I tried with multiple people, multiple houses, it just didn't matter. Um, yeah, just combine that all together and it just was a bad fit for me, so I just never picked it back up. Only good for co-op on PC. The, the console plebs suffer, yeah, see. Yeah, they're still hurting. <laughs> yeah, when I eventually get to the one and only Elden Ring challenge run that I owe the community, uh, when I get to that, you can rest assured that I will give my full opinion on that video. Which means that video is probably going to be disliked to hell, but, <laughs> but it's okay. If I'm going to say my piece, I'm going to say it somewhere. Elden Ring does most of the things Dark Souls 2 did, but somehow worse. Uh... Maybe? I don't know. I guess... I don't know. I won't- I won't say yes or no on that. Oh, come on now! Alright, well. Stab the wheel, at least. <laughs> Will I do a Sekiro lemon? <laughs> lemon. Will I do a Sekiro challenge? Uh, probably not. Um... Probably not, no. Uh, I think, uh, Sekiro is- The other reason I don't like Sekiro very much is that you have a single build. I know you can kind of mess around with the tools a little bit, but... I don't really feel like those are supposed to be, like, your main weapon, obviously. Oh, god, excuse me. Good lord. Um, yeah, those aren't meant to be your main weapons, so I, you really are just stuck with a katana, and I am not a big fan of using katanas, if I'm being completely honest. I'm more of a long sword, aka anything else kind of guy, so... Doesn't, doesn't work. It can't be disliked, YouTube, remove that. That's where you're wrong, kiddo. <laughs> no, it, uh, you can still dislike videos. I still see dislike ratios on my videos. And people have developed apps on, like, the internet to, uh, so you can still see a dislike ratio if you want to. So if you really want to know, it's there. I promise. I don't know why YouTube did that. Honestly, it didn't hurt anybody except the viewer. Because now, how am I supposed to know if... Like, the video I'm watching on how to fix a fridge is accurate, or if they're telling me to do something silly. Bad, YouTube. Bad. Elder Ring, Firebomb, and Crossbow only? Not Crossbow, no. Uh, but there will be, uh, Firebomb only, yes. That is the one and only, uh, challenge run I'm willing to do. Mainly because that's the only weapon I've felt so far that actually feels good. Everything else does not feel right for me. 
Elden Ring feels like playing through the Shrine of Amana for hours. Thank you. Yes. That is that is an equivalent feeling, I would say. Where you're just kind of walking around, not really sure what to do. Well, for me, anyway. Again, for me. Not really sure what to do. I feel like every time I go somewhere, we're like, ah, this must be a place that has something. I get there and it gives me something I didn't really want or need. I'm like, at the end of it, I'm like, okay. Which is similar to Bloodborne. In the sense that, like, you would go find all these secret treasure chests and it was all just chalice dungeon materials at the end. You're like, why? <laughs> I want a new weapon. Yeah, okay, here's some blood, here's, uh, here's some blood flowers. Thanks, I'm so happy. Now I can go suffer in the chalice dungeon again. You're so nice. Yeah, it's just, I don't know. I don't know. Not for me. Enough said. Enough said. Yes, the the firebomb only run is important for backlog lore. Exactly. It is the pinnacle. It is the pinnacle of the story. The end of the story. And that is that. Retro Chad loves Iron Keep. Everyone, uh, don't listen to anything they say. They're. <laughs> <laughs> Invalid opinion. <laughs> no. You can like it if you like. It's an interesting location. Personally, I hate it. Because of the uh, the enemy density. I feel like the enemy density is uh, not good there. But uh, you do you, boo-boo. What is the run that I'm doing? I am doing a boss, uh, boss weapon run. I did not grab anything. Um... Right now we have the Chaos Blade, but every time we kill a boss, we get their weapon. So, alright. Up next, I have that I should go... I have that I should go kill Pinwheel and get the Silver Serpent Ring. However, I did not realize we'd be doing this well as far as our stats go. So, we're going to ignore my, my little note there. We're going to go straight for the Gargoyles. Let's do it. I can't go that way. We need to go the other way. Oh, this is going to be bad. We have to go through the main area with this thing. <laughs> With this weapon? Oh no. <laughs> Alright, what kind of damage am I doing? I didn't I haven't even thought about it. This is all physical too? Oh, that's even worse. I thought there'd be fire damage. Alright. Well, he dies in one hit, but there goes a chunk of my health. Basically need to speedrun and not get hit. Cool. Really cool. Come on, controller. Come here. There we go. All right. Am I gonna kill Ornstein or Smo? You have to kill Ornstein or Smo. Oh, oh, you mean which one? Uh, well, we're gonna kill them both, and then chat will get to decide which weapon we get. Anytime a boss allows for two weapons, like, uh, for example, the gargoyles that are coming up, they have both the axe and the halberd. So chat will get to decide which one we use. Which I know I will, re I'm gonna regret that later in the game. But for now, we're just going to allow it. Choose my fate, chat. Choose my fate. Also, it's kind of cool because, like, I imagine what's going to happen is you guys are going to choose the weapons that no one ever picks. Like, no one really picks this Chaos Blade. If it was this or Fury Sword, you'd pick Fury Sword every time. So now you get to see. <laughs> chat decides, i.e. we're using Smo's Hammer. Yeah, probably. Joke's on you guys. It regenerates health. It is quite literally the opposite of what we're using right now. Ow. There we go. What's the R what's the R2 on this thing? Oh, it's that move. Oh, that move sucks. Okay. Well, might as well get me some powder for later. Do, do, do. As much as like choices wouldn't make sense for the last two that dies. Eh, I mean, keep by game logic, yes. But if you think about it, I'm just in the room with two dead bodies, so you know, like, I can pick. <laughs> Logically, ow. <laughs> Logically, ow. <laughs> oh, boy. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. Alright. How is Smo pronounced? I don't know. You know, 
I don't think anybody knows. Unless it's a name in another... In another language that, like, other people actually have, I don't think we have a reference point to use. It's like, it's like Sif. Like, is it Sif? Is it Sif? Who knows? All I know is that if you take the letters S-I-F on your keyboard and move them all to the right by one letter, it spells dog. That's all I know. <laughs> Don't believe me? Look at your keyboard. Alright. Get out of here. Go away. I think it's German. Is it? I don't know about that. I've never heard that name. <laughs> it's supposed to pronounce Quinn. Ah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Witchcraft. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> Taught you something new today. All right, let's let's get out of here. <laughs> He's a witch. <laughs> oh. You're welcome. You're welcome. Dad taught you something new today. Listen to your elders. Sometimes we know things. Alright, get out of here. Man, even when I hit the two enemies with one hit, it still takes off the same amount of health. That's rough. That's rough. Okay. Doesn't work. <laughs> oh, sorry. Yeah, it works on American keyboards. I don't know about the other ones. Let's see. Nope, can't use it. Okay, so we're probably not going to be able to use this on literally anything. Cool. Great. Awesome. All right, there's our boss boy. Thanks for coming to this lemon talk. <laughs> See, that's what, that's, the, that's what you get for coming to a stream. When you come to a stream, you'll learn things. Plunge attack on Taurus Demon? Of course. Of course, why wouldn't we? Yeep. Ooh, that damage though. Dang, all right. Wow. Okay, get wrecked. <laughs> Jeez. Yeah, that'll work. Cool. Alright, well, let's um let's change our weapon. I realize I'm going a little out of order from what I intended to do, but uh that's okay, it's fine. Well, with our stats being what they are, I'm not too worried about it. Alright, so I need to go to weapons. Chaos blade. And now we're going to change that to Demon's Great Axe. Yeah, that one. You're telling me that's not a thing? You want to think about that? There you go. There we go. That's better. Boop, boop. Now, I do have enough strength to wield it with two hands. Excellent. We're good. When do you ever go in order? Yeah, yeah good point. Good point. Okay. Torrent didn't even get a chance to calculate the damage, I know. <laughs> yeah, no, he didn't he didn't last very long. Didn't give me much in the way of uh, levels for stuff either. Alright, get that going. Hey buddy. Slayer, I love you. I don't need your weapon right now. I might need it later though, so you know. Stay over there. Don't go anywhere. All right. I hope this goes for six hours. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why would you do that? Let's see. Am I going to kill the red dragon? Uh, no. I mean, we can later, but right now, no. I don't want the Drake Sword. Drake Sword would not be a good fit for my purposes. All right. Well, now you know. The uh, Chaos Blade is good. All right. 34 strength should get you, because 34 divided by 2, let's do math, chat, is uh, 17. So 17 plus 34 is going to be 44 plus another 7 is 51. Is that right? Yeah, that should be right. So with 51, that is good enough to use everything except Smo's hammer, which I think requires 59 strength. The freaking mad lad. Um... So we're gonna need, I guess we are gonna need a couple more points in strength just to make sure that you guys don't completely screw me over in the later, in the later game. All right. Did I forget the ladder? No, no, I got it. We're good, we're good. 
58 strength? Okay, yeah. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> you say get Ornsteins, but we both know that, uh... <laughs> we both know that Chad is going to tell me to get the hammer, so... We gotta be ready for that. We gotta be ready for that. After I level strength, we go for Ornstein's spear. <laughs> Well, hopefully, my goal is for, hopefully, to have enough stats to account for any weapon by the time we get to that point. If I do it right, we should be okay. Alright, how's the gun game work? If we kill a boss, we get its weapon. That's how it works. Out of way. Yeah, that'll work. This weapon will do. Honestly, our main problem at this point is probably just going to be, uh my uh, move speed like the fact that I have to probably fat roll in the future or right now apparently yeah you're you uh, that I think that and the fact that I'm gonna have to avoid putting points into health for a long time just to make sure that you <laughs> just to make sure things don't get too goofed oh, let's go kill some gargoyles let's go kill some gargoyles Ow, ow, ow. Hello. Oh, okay. Right, friends. Now, this does bring the question of when do I torture myself with the butterfly shield? Although, would you guys want to even see the butterfly shield? I've done a whole video on it. We could use the spear. How cool would that be? Just saying. Huh? Huh? Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, to be fair, we're only mid-rolling. Exactly, yeah. We're doing okay for now. We're doing okay for now. <laughs> the mage build needs no health. The mage build takes health away. <laughs> yeah. Honestly, if a mage build can use the uh, the spear, it's so good. It's a great weapon for mages. Because it just does straight magic damage and scales with intelligence. Which won't be good for us, but, like, you know, could be good for everyone else. Just saying. Alright, let's see. We don't need to talk to Andre. So let's just get going. Butterfly shield his ass? I know. I've beaten the game with it. It was a bad time. Doable, but a bad time. A mage build with 58 strength. <laughs> I'm a mage. I cast bonk. Yeah. Axe of the Dragon King? That's coming up. That's coming up. There we go. Unless this is a reference to something, in which case, then yes, it is. Probably a reference I don't understand. Do I play D&D? I love D&D. D&D is fantastic. I haven't been able to play it lately, because my group is currently on hiatus due to uh, IRL stuff. Man, that guy's almost dead already. But, uh... Mrs. Lemon and I like to play together sometimes, where we just have like a one-on-one -on -one campaign where she plays and I am the DM. She is very good at it. <laughs> she, she is very good at one-on-one -on -one scenarios. It's really fun to see. Now let's just get this going there. Alright. IRL stuff boring? Trust me, I know. If I didn't have IRL stuff to do, I would be thrilled. But it just doesn't work. I have considered on the second channel doing a D&D uh, firebomb talk. Or not talk, but like, just doing a video on like, Alright, so, here's how you do a firebomb only run in D&D. In, uh, in D &D. And just doing that. Just really lax, just kind of a goof off video. I really do need to add some more content to the second channel. Like I said, this this month has been really bad for content creation for me. Um, just because my weekends are all spoken for, so I don't have that extra 16 hours to throw together things. Um, yeah, yeah, you're... But I'd love to make... I need to make some more shorts. I have a couple of games I've been playing on the side that I'd love to make some videos on. Hello, hello. Um, I want to make some, like, D&D content just for fun. I don't know. There's a couple things I want to throw on that channel. That's my garbage channel. It'd be fun. What's the best class and why is it Cleric? Uh, well, you just answer your own question. Best class is Cleric. Because it is versatile. Or versatile. Whatever, however you pronounce that. Whichever country you're from. Uh, yeah. Cleric is great. I love Cleric. 
Channel Divinity Firebomb. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Alright. Lightning urns are greater than fire bombs? Get out. <laughs> they're good if you're they're good if you have a if you're a holy character, yes. I will agree with that. Alright. Are the Tony shirts US sizes? Uh actually if you go to it, if you go to the channel or not the channel. If you go to the website where the uh, shirts are being sold, they actually do have the measurements, like a measurement thing for you. So I don't think so. Or they might be. I don't know. It depends what country you're from. You know, if you say, like, is that a U.S. size, but I don't know what your reference is. Uh, but they have all the inches uh, of how big they are, so you don't have to guess. Which is nice. Take your lumps. Take your lumps. Get off my roof. Ow. <laughs> Alright. Didn't realize you were down here already. Little tip top. There we go. Get around the fire. Give you a talking to. Alright. Thought you'd be dead by now. Don't you do it. There we go. We got this. We got this. Okay. Just want to get rid of you. If I can get rid of you, I'll be happy. If you both cast fire like this, it's going to get really annoying really fast. Come here. Alright. One down. What does the R2 on this weapon do? What is the strong attack? I honestly don't know. probably really slow, so we're gonna do this. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 266, okay. Not bad. Not bad. Man, my controller is busted. What's a normal base to? 196? Okay. So worth it, but not. That's cool. Alright. Easy peasy. Big bunk. <laughs> Jump attack? Huzzah! Yeah, you're right. We probably should have done that. That's okay. There's a D&D YouTuber who screams for Fireball every short. <laughs> yeah, but Fireball isn't Firebomb. Fireball is easy mode. Or also TPK, depending. <laughs> oh, God. All right. So, let's get this pull going. Let's get this pull going. That's the highest damage we'll see this run? Yeah, maybe. We'll see. All right. One second. So, let's do this poll. Not gonna even. Which weapon? Axe. Halberd. Go! Alright. Make it happen, Captain. Make your voice known. Make your voices known. Oh, gosh. Oh, boy. Simon! I always enjoy what you do. Thank you for the entertainment. Well, thank you. I appreciate that. Thank you so much for the donation. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> the oath of throwing it back. Ha! Ah. Someone's a someone's a D and D quicks fan. I see, or whatever it's called. I'm sorry, I don't remember the act one. Don't remember the actual name of the channel, but yes, great D and D YouTuber for sure. Asking rang <laughs> the asking rise up. I don't know, guys. I don't know. I don't know if you guys can see what I see, but uh, it's looking like the halberd's winning. Keep going. <laughs> Make your voice heard. One shot quips. Thank you. Yes, that is them. How many times have I completed Dark Souls 1? I'm afraid to answer that question. <laughs> I am afraid to answer that question. Floppy halberd for more kinetic energy. I don't know if it's actually floppy. I know the axes, but... What do I think of the changes for 1 D&D? You know, I actually haven't seen uh, what that's going to be. One-shot questers, yes, thank you, yes. Um, I haven't seen what they were doing with that yet. Um, I saw that there was an announcement debate. I haven't checked in on it. I'm used to playing 3.5 and 5e. Those are the ones I do. Did I watch Critical Role? I have, um, all my, I have a group of friends that kind of fill me in on what's going on with it. I don't really have the time to watch eight-hour streams every week, or at this point, I guess it's couple hundreds of hours of content 
So I know what happened, and I watched the animated show, which was really great. Um, which I understand was like just one of their many arcs, but uh, it's good stuff. I'm glad they have it, and I love that their community gets so excited about it. I just don't have the time to catch up on all of it. But if I had a job that let me listen to music uh, like I used to, uh, I would be totally on board with that. You don't like one D&D &D and you don't think you'll play it? That's fine. It's all good. That's why they have all the versions. All right. I think we're just about ready. Looks like the Halberd's going to go. Looks like Halberd is going to win it. Give you about ten more seconds, just in case there's anyone holding off. Do I watch or listen to Just Roll With It? No, I haven't heard of them before. Uh, might be interesting to listen to on a car ride. But uh, the only the only D and D campaign I've listened to fully for a podcast was um, the Adventure Zone, the first the first uh, season, which was really good. I was really happy with that. Tale of the Absurd? No, no. Oh wait, I do know Absurd. Yes, that is a terrible character. <laughs> that is an absolutely terrible character. Never make that character. All right, that's enough. End pull. Looks like we're going with the Halberd, boys and girls. Do I? Is there a Demon Souls challenge run in the works? There is. The Firebomb run is currently in the works. Everyone love Absurd. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Will I equip the helmet? No. No, no, we don't need that. And again, anyone who's bought the shirts during the stream or after the stream or any other time, just want to say thank you so much. Really appreciate you. Tony appreciates you too. All right, let's get this party back on the road here. So, we need to go into this, unequip that, go over to weapons, go down to it. Oh, I already had the axe. Okay, well, that's fun. Um, and now we're going to change it to gargoyle. I think it's just called the gargoyle help, isn't it? Is that right? Or am I wrong? Tail axes. I've seen a lot of tail axes. Nope. Mm, Alright, someone's got to fill me in on the actual name here. I need to find it. <laughs> Help! What about the cargo shield? Yeah, okay. <laughs> We're not doing that. <laughs> Why was it the shield an option? Because <laughs> it's not a weapon. It doesn't count. Oh god. Oh yeah, no, stream's not frozen. We're just uh we're just taking our time, that's all. Axe and Halberd. It's called the Gargoyle's Halberd? Okay, so why isn't it popping up here? Why isn't it? We've got regular Halberds here. There it is, Gargoyle Halberd. Alright, we got it. I was oh, it's spelled weird. Or or I'm spelling it wrong. Okay, that would explain it. Boop boop. We got it. Okay, what are we looking at? Well, with our massive strength, it's getting a little bit of extra attack, so that's good. Uh, is this one of those weapons where you get a resistance bonus? Oh yeah, look at that. Poison, toxic, and bleed. How about that? Cool. All right. It does damage, it counts. Yeah, okay. <laughs> All right, buddy. Stenley. You really appreciate the stream, but you gotta go? Alright. <laughs> Thanks for stopping by. Really appreciate you. Have yourself a good one, alright? Okay. Not enough strength the more. We'll get more. Relax. <laughs> we'll, we'll get more. We'll get more. Wannabe! That's sadly all the time you have for now, but you'll be re-watching. Good. And to quote our amazing host, stay safe, be good to one another, and I'll see you all soon. Aww. Thank you, Lemon, for all the enjoyment you give us. Not a problem. Thanks for watching. Couldn't do it without you. Have yourself a good one. 99 strength or go home? No. <laughs> 99 strength would be a waste. A waste. Nope, there's our boy. We're going to let him be our boy for a little bit longer. Elder Ring Challenge runs in the future? In the very, very far future, yes. And just one. Just one. 
Do you admit <laughs> my videos motivated you to beat Dark Souls 1? You know, I am glad that every time people tell me like, Hey, I beat Dark Souls 1 with your tips, and hey, Salt and Sanctuary is really good, and I'm really glad I played it, and your tips helped me out. It's always really cool to see. Because I know my videos are mostly just like dad jokes, and just, hey, if you were interested, here's how you beat the game with a stupid weapon. But, uh, it is really nice to see that some of my tips that I accidentally come up with uh, during those runs actually help people. So, I really like that. Is the brightness always this low? Uh, yep, yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Don't worry, we're getting somewhere, uh, we're getting somewhere a little lighter in the future. Patrick, welcome. Thank you so much for joining. Enjoy those emotes and wallpapers. It's a miserable challenge for Elden Ring, isn't it? I mean, it's fire bombs only, so yes. Also, all 155 bosses, so yes, yes. <laughs> yeah. Dad jokes? Is Lemon allowed to have a citrus fruit? No, I'm allowed to tell dad jokes. I'm old. You don't know me. What? Firekeeper's absent. Already? How did that happen? How did that happen? Wait a minute. Almost must be because we're out of order. Ugh, dang it. Alright, well, in any case, since Fortress is open, I guess that's something. But we've got some more bosses to kill. We just gotta make sure we don't lose these souls. That could be bad. Ah, that could be bad. Let's, let's, let's not do that. <laughs> Lemon's older than Quinn? Yeah, probably. No crossers for Elden Ring? Nah, I don't think so. I don't think so. Though I will say, uh, Crossbow Only is coming out, hopefully, if everything goes well, uh, coming out this weekend. Let's see. We could kill the... Yeah, let's go kill the butterfly. Let's go kill the butterfly. I'm feeling spicy. Um... But yeah, we should be finishing the Dark Souls Crossbow Saga coming up, which is great. <laughs> you too are super old? Well, here's the thing. Being old is cool, so, like, you know, don't let them get to you. <laughs> don't don't let the chat get to you. They don't, know, they don't know what the 90s and 80s were like. They just don't know. They're missing out. They just don't know it. <laughs> Backlog's back for a day. Well, I like the game. Like I said, I don't know if I could ever do anything with it, but I would love to just make some second channel content with it. That'd be fun. That'd be a good time. Yeah, here are you. Not even Lemon knows how old Lemon is. It's true. Chaos Grandpa. <laughs> love that name. Great, great content. Keep up the work. Thank you so much. Thanks for stopping by and thanks for the donation. Yeah, here are you. All right, Derek, coming back for four months. Much appreciated. It's Skenjin. Since you like SNS Death Gambit, might be fun for you. I've heard that it has uh, fire bombs, so yeah, we have to give that a look at some point, for sure. Why are we going to the forest? Because a butterfly lives here, and we want it. Are we gonna do Dark Souls Three Crossbow Only Run? Give me three days. Give me about three days, and you'll see what I and you'll see what happened. <laughs> Play as Gwyn Challenge Run, Grandpa Gwyn Lemon. Nah, I, honestly, I would do something similar to that, but I don't think there's any Play as an Enemy mod for Dark Souls One. Game has fire bombs equals good game. Nah, I wish I could say that's true, but unfortunately, that's not always the case. But game has fire bombs means I'll try it. If a game has fire bombs, it means I can make it work. Or at the very least, get through it once. The Firebomb Academy must live on, after all. Absol! Gotta bounce. Thanks for the giggles. Have something planned for my birthday. Aw, can't wait for the shirt. I can't wait for you to get the shirt either. Thanks for stopping by, and so much for the. I uh, really appreciate the donation there. Have a good one. <laughs> Tarkus. <laughs> you want Tarkus? <laughs> Uh, that would be kind of funny. Nah. Come on. Come on. Alright, well, it's not great magic defense, but we can make that work. 
probably kill this guy in about two rotations. So we just need her to cooperate with us. We'll be all right. Disco Elysium. You know, I've never played it. I think that'd be fun. Uh, Titanite demons do count as mini bosses. So if we kill a Titanite demon with our weapon, we do get the Titanite uh, catch pull. Yeah, that's true. Fallout 4 Molotov only. I've heard a lot of people suggesting that. Yeah. I haven't played Fallout 4 in a long time. That'd be, that could be interesting, though. Just kind of running through the main quest line with that. Probably doing a couple side quests as well, just for fun. Magicka 2 with only fire. <laughs> Honestly, that game was kind of a struggle for me. The controls just kind of took it out of me. Alright, what are we looking at here? That's not bad. Wish it was a little bit better, but... I can make it work. What's R2 do? Oh, okay. Alright, well... About two rotations. Maybe three. Probably three. Just gotta dodge most of these attacks here and we'll be okay. Chaos Y Hander after pinwheel? <laughs> no, no weapon, no boss drops his Chaos Y Hander, <laughs> unfortunately. If only. Ow. All right, come on down. You've had your fun, come on down. Well, you're getting hungry. I know you are. Let's go. Come get your nibbles. Oh, wow. That did not hit the thing like I wanted to. Okay. That's a bummer. A darn. Have I heard of Mitten Squad? I have heard of the Mitten Squad, Michigan man. Yes. Fist only run? Never. Are you also friends with Vati? No. No, I do not know Vati. Believe it or not, YouTubers do not all know each other. <laughs> hard, hard, just hard to understand. I know. <laughs> Am I planning to check out Dark Souls Remastered? Not really, not really. I don't do a whole lot of mods, if I'm being completely honest. And there's enough games out there nowadays that it's not like I, you know, I'm just kind of jonesing for more Dark Souls. It's like eh, I got plenty more runs to do and. A lot more games to try, so not in the huge rush. Died to the butterfly. F. Yeah, well, <laughs> these things happen. Here, maybe we have something that's a little bit more magic resistance. Defense 20. Yeah, you'll do. Still, still quick rolling. All right, good. There we go. I put on a shirt. Are you guys happy? <laughs> Pinwheel drops the bone wheel shield. Not the last time I checked. <laughs> Good try. Thank you for not killing me with my, for my sword. You're welcome. Just, uh, no promises in the future. We Chat might kind of make that happen, so... Keep chat on your good side there, Solar, and you should be fine. I thought you guys got a YouTuber club. Who told you? <laughs> no. I think I can count the number of times I've talked to another YouTuber on, like, one hand. Um, or the number of YouTubers I've talked to. Let's put it that way. The number of YouTubers I've talked to, I can count on one hand. Are we ever going to do a bathtub stream? Unfortunately, no. No, we will not be doing that. YouTube does not allow that, and I stopped streaming anything on Twitch, so... You know, we're kind of out of... Out of options on that one. 131 for most of my thing, or basically the same thing. Okay, yeah, no. R1 to victory it is. Let's do it. I've got time. All right. Hey! Nah, oh well. <laughs> Worth a shot. I have not played Soul Knight, no. I have not. Pinwheel drops a mask, use that as a weapon. I mean, I'll use the mask. If chat wants me to take the mask and use it, I'll gladly use that. That's no problem by me. But it, uh, can't use it as a weapon. Doubled enemies with daggers only. Honestly, daggers themselves are not very good in Dark Souls, unfortunately. At least Dark Souls 1, I should say. So, uh, just a dagger only run would probably be 
more than enough of a challenge. So, maybe that in the future. I don't know. We'll see. If I decide to do something like that, uh, there'll be a poll. Whenever I do, like, single weapon only challenges, I like to see which one chat wants to see next. So keep an eye out for that. Oh, oh. Okay, we're fine. Coming down yet? No. Solar body pillow win. I hate to say it, but we've been beaten to the punch. Someone's already got it. <laughs> Feel free to buy from them. Alright, you. One. Two. Three. One. Two. Uh. Uh. Okay. Okay. One more rotation how to do it. I think that goes through that wall. It sure does. So does that! Ow! Well, that explains why we got hit last time. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god! Are you kidding? Are you kidding me? Uh. See you later, Derek. Dang it. Can I mod a pestle, huh? Pest clock Dark Souls 1. I mean, you could just add poison damage to your dagger. That's always an option. Oh boy. Have I ever thought of playing Kingsfield or Shadow Tower? Um, I've thought about Kingsfield. I've been interested in just kind of playing through that series just to see what it's like. Do I only stream on YouTube? Sure do. Twitch is not very good for. Uh, it's not a good deal, I should say. For streamers at the moment you know there's a lot of people over there that are so established into twitch that they're, they're kind of stuck so they have to kind of deal with it but twitch is really putting the pressure on them right now and it's not a good scene that and i just don't really like their uh, policies <laughs> their policies have been very weird just roll forward in front of it no attacks can hit you ah like that <laughs> well we'll test that theory sure why not I think I might have to be behind a little bit of a wall here. Okay, so far, so, so far it's true. You liar! <laughs> nah, just kidding. Uh, dang it. Ah, well. Fist only Skyrim? Ah, Skyrim's so easy to break. Then I'm sure someone's done it. What edition of D&D do I prefer? I like 5e, just because it lets you tell stories a lot easier. And because there's a lot less math involved. It, I, I have a lot more fun, like, just goofing off with my friends and, like, you know, being murder hobos and everything else. As opposed to metamaxing my, uh, my character. Like, let me put it this way. In 3.5, also, Jagger, thank you so much for joining. Really appreciate you. Um, in 3.5, I decided I wanted to be Iron Tarkus, so I made Iron Tarkus. Except, instead of using a giant greatsword, I just had a... Oh god. I had heavy enough armor and a tower shield and I think an off shield in my offhand. Like just another shield in my offhand. And my AC was so high into the numbers. Like I was at like 44 AC. Like dragons couldn't hit me. Like that's how broken 3.5 can get if you just kind of mess with the numbers. So I didn't, 5e kind of avoids that which is nice. That said, my DM was very clever, and he just pushed me into the water and drowned me, but, you know, still, it, <laughs> for everything else, it worked fine. <laughs> we're just gonna... We're just gonna fight the butterfly like I normally do. It's fine. Ow. Seriously. Enough of that. Did you get out of here? My god. Who would have thought we'd be stuck on the butterfly for a long period of time? <laughs> Not I. One shot every boss run when? Oh man, I would love to. I'm fairly certain it can be done. But it would take a lot of monumental effort, so... That would be a thing. At least the way I'm thinking of it. Because if you just use Dark Bead, then it's like, okay, well, you know. But then you also need to get Dark Bead, though, so that's kind of a thing, isn't it? I don't know. Needs more research, let me put it that way. Game for old people. You take that back. <laughs> no. Uh, honestly, I think um, 3.5 is more based for the 
uh, original audience of D&D, which was... Uh, what, what was it called? War Gamers. D&D used to be... Based, is based on war games, so uh, they kind of that kind of emphasis on math was much bigger back then. But now it's more about telling stories and having a good time, which is really nice because it makes it much more inclusive. Like you don't have to be a good role player to still just sit down and enjoy a table. So I like that. Yampa did the one-shot kill, I think. Uh, I think you're thinking of Inferno Plus. I'm pretty sure he did it. Um, but I'd have to double check. Oh, we got a bot again. Now, good. They've come up with new words. <laughs> Looks like I'm gonna have to be in the word find love, which is unfortunate because uh, <laughs> it's really unfortunate because maybe somebody wants to tell me to find love, and that'd be nice. Bots ruining all the good phrases. Come on down. There you go. That's the spirit. I'm coming for you, bot. Give me a minute. Ugh, nah, not gonna get it. Not gonna get it. Okay. Did I plat Splinter Cell Blacklist? You're asking me if I platinumed anything? <laughs> My channel's called The Backlogs, do you think? <laughs> no. No, I have uh, I have platinumed very few games in my life. Ow. Simply because, especially nowadays, a lot of games like basically require you to no-life their game in order to get 100%. It feels like... I don't know. Achievements are kind of weird these days. I don't really bother with them anymore. Oh my god! <laughs> Alright. Chug, chug a lug. Oh god, no! <laughs> and I don't have a humanity on, on my hotbar. Cool. That's fine. We'll do it live. It's gonna be fine. Come on down. Just 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 come on down. That's all I need you to do. Come on down, please. Ah, oh, you saint. Take your lumps. Appreciate you. <laughs> Woo! All right. Let me just count a lot of game. <laughs> yeah. Favorite music while playing games? Um, I don't usually listen to music while I'm playing games. Uh, usually I'm listening to the music of the games. But if I am grinding or doing something like that, I tend to listen to more upbeat music. And listen to more upbeat music. What's this song? This is, I think, the RoboCop from Nintendo, uh, from the Game Boy Color. It's on Game Boy. Yeah, but it's RoboCop. If you can believe it. Good music, isn't it? Right, get me out of here. Get me out of here. All right. Let me sit down. There we go. What's the song limit? It's bugging me. All right, all right. I'll look it up for you. Uh, we are currently listening to RoboCop title theme from Game Boy. So, a game none of you have ever played. Because <laughs> you guys don't remember what a real Game Boy is. Not a real Game Boy. I mean, Game Boy, period. Just just Game Boy. No, no additional words. All right, chat. It is time. It is time for you all to tell me how this next run is going to go. Let's get that pull going. Which weapon? We've got the shield or we've got the spear. Let's go. Let's go. Magnus, thank you so much. What does that say? How many of the bosses have you beaten so far? And thanks for the second shirt. <laughs> you're, you're very welcome. Um... I have beaten probably about five or six bosses right about now. About five or six. <laughs> Lemon thinks every viewer is 14. No, I think every viewer is 18. <laughs> if, uh, if YouTube statistics are telling me true, most of my viewers are between the ages of 18 and 24. Give or take. Which sounds old. 
to and to everyone who's 18 to 24, it all feels like you guys are old. You're like, ah, yes, I'm an adult. And you are. And you are. Full credit. You made it that far. Congratulations. Enjoy your right to vote. Enjoy your right to drink, smoke, or whatever the age of consent is for you. But I also think that you're 24, whereas I am older than 24. So when I say, like, ah, yes, I remember, a lot of you don't at this point. Because we're in 2022, which means you were born in 2000 or so. Which means uh, you don't remember what the internet starting up was. <laughs> you don't remember the first days of the internet and what that was like. So, uh, yep, see, there we go. <laughs> all right, everyone, uh, go ahead and dox all these people. And uh... <laughs> No. Yeah, so just saying, like, a lot of people in chat don't remember what the dial-up sounds were on YouTube or the fact that you could hear people talking on the phone if you were trying to use the internet while someone was using a phone. Or what uh, what uh, spinning phones were. Do you remember the uh, the rotational phones where you had to <laughs> that noise when you had to pick a letter or a letter, pick a number? Good lord. Life was hard, but also good. Already older than a quarter of a century. Well, that's good. Enjoy your first quarter. I hope they stopped making Game Boys in 2003. Lemon. <laughs> well, they stopped making them, but people didn't use them. Like. You didn't use it when you were one year old. Don't lie. That's why they call it dialing. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ben's got the noise effect there. <laughs> oh, God. <sighs> Y'all remember AOL Messenger? I remember AOL Messenger. For AIM, as the cool kids called it. <laughs> Paying for 400 kilobit internet. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Paying for DSL. Oh, God. I want, I want to look up how to play Monster Hunter 1. Better wait three hours for the, <laughs> for this page to load. All right. Poll is over, by the way. Poll is over. Jagger finally cracked and bought Salt and Sanctuary. Any advice for someone going in completely blind? Uh, just play it as it feels. Just have fun. <laughs> just have fun with it. Play a build that looks interesting to you. If you need extra help... I do have one or two how-to videos. Um, I should make another one later, but I do have a couple that might help you out as far as getting started goes. So give that a look. Thank you so much for the donation. Uh, hold on, everyone's, everyone's jumping in now. Hold on a minute. Roundish wheel. <laughs> sure, Grandpa, let's get you to bed. I'm not that old! Dave, okay, but can we talk Space Channel 5? <laughs> That's what we're listening to. Alrighty, in any case, the chat has chosen... Ladies and gentlemen, I kind of missed the result there. I wasn't looking. Uh, we're going Spear. Oh, you're too kind. You're all too kind. So, with that being the case, we're going to need a couple points into Intelligence, which might be a slight problem. I have not prepared for that. But, in any case, uh, where's my halberd? First things first. Unequip. And halberd. Okay. And go to our friendly mod and go to oh what the heck is it called? It's called a crystal spear. Is that right? Uh no, moonlight. It's moonlight. There it is. Yeah, sure, whatever. Okay, and there it is. All right, what do we need? Fourteen intelligence. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. Oh, <laughs> oh no. All right. Do I have any boss souls? Well, that's not going to help us very much. Oh, boy. You screwed me over, chat. <laughs> you animals. <laughs> oh, God. The shield beckons you. God, it might. All right. How much does it cost me to level up here? About four. 4,000 more. This, the butterfly soul does not help in that regard. It only gives you about 1,200. Mm, and I'm going to tell you right now, this da oh, it's going to do about 30 damage when I'm done with it. Awesome. Yay. <laughs> Let's give that a test run, shall we? Let's go see. All right, well, I guess you know what we can do. We can technically just go grind on the bridge at this point. 
Joke's on you, chat. <laughs> oh, God. Take away one pain only to give another. I know. <laughs> Sell butterfly to Framp if you can. Does he take it for more? I feel like he doesn't. Eh. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> well, that ain't gonna work. Now is it? Okay. Feed the souls to Framp. Okay. Yeah, he should be awake by now. We should be able to do that. Good call. Good call. Get out of the way. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. Relax. 12 to 8,000. Okay, that's pretty good. I do have a backup plan. I did have a couple backup plans just in case something happens. Isn't the butterfly still 4,000? No. No, it's not. It's really bad. This game was rigged from the start. <laughs> I should have known better. When Chad was immediately like, oh yeah, no, let him use the spear. Let him use the spear. I should have known somebody was doing math in the background and starting a rallying cry. I should have known. Allen Ring fire pots only? It's in the works. Give it six months. Give me six months. Punching would be more effective? I know. I know. What's my favorite secret I discovered in Dark Souls? Um, Ash Lake. Ash Lake was really cool. I guess I liked Painted World as well. That was pretty cool, too. Until the skeletons got in, then, then it hurt. <laughs> do the math. They had the wiki pulled up. That counts. How do you think I do math? How do you think I do math? Go to Ash Lake and get the dragon sword. Do you realize how long we'd be there? <laughs> if with me doing two... Doing two damage per hit? Oh my god, we'd be there forever. No. No, no, no. Bioshock Infinite Challenge? Well, uh, Tonics only is, uh, on the docket. We're gonna... We just did Bioshock 2, so we have to let that one kind of simmer for a bit, but, uh... I would like to finish the series off. So that'd be good. Math is hard, I know. What's this song? Um, I think it's something... It's definitely Pokemon... Someone in chat will tell you. I don't remember which one it is. Uh, okay, where are we at? What are we doing here? Tonics is only is gonna suck, though. Yeah, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. I'll find a way. It has been getting progressively harder, though. I will admit that. Hey, pal. Yeah, sure do. Robo Kitty. Four months. Welcome back. Wanted to wish you good luck with your run on break. Aw, you're on break. Congratulations. Also, goddammit, Tony. <laughs> <laughs> also, God damn it, Tony! P.S. Buy shirts, people. Robo Kitty is correct. If you haven't bought a shirt, you're running low on time. You've got about less. You've got less than 24 hours. Oh wow, it does sell for 8,000. Hey hey. Good call, chat. We should be doing that more often. And here I thought the Snake Man was useless. But yeah, you've got less than 24 hours to buy a shirt. So if you haven't done so yet, go now. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Bioshock Revolver only? Nah. Guns are easy. Guns are easy. Alright, let's see here. Butterfly Spear. Yep. Yep. I, I'm seeing here in my notes that uh, at Ceaseless, I was supposed to push those points into Intelligence. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Good job, me. Uh, okay, anyway. Uh, we do need to get these this thing pushed up. Best place would probably be the bridge just to get some free souls there although I do have an idea or two I can kick a few things off ledges I could I could cheat you all of this victory could cheat you all of this victory and just kick a, a knight off the cliff and get a halberd but I don't know uh, I don't know <laughs> optical no worries my man no worries. We've got a bunch of other ideas coming down the line, so I don't blame you one bit. Um, just, uh, you know, just wait for a shirt that speaks to you. <laughs> That's what I'd do. That's what I would do. Alright, I think we can make it. I think I can, I think I can, I think I can. Oh god, now my controller tells me no! Controller, I know we've been through a lot together, but I need you to <laughs> I need you to pull through for me one last time. Come on. Oh, the pig. Rest of the bomber, rest of the bomber, rest of the bomber. Okay. 
All right, let's take that intelligence. Three more levels. Hooray. Run this way. Gentlemen. Let's see if our dragon friend is anywhere to be found. I hope he is. Yep, there he is. There we go. All right, chat. We're gonna be doing this for a little bit. We're gonna be doing this for a bit. Will I do a Hollow Knight run? I honestly haven't actually beaten that game yet. Um, I got uh, I got up to Hornet and then life got in the way. And I never picked it back up. So I do owe that game a proper play. Toddman, thank you so much for joining. Enjoy your emotes, enjoy your wallpaper. Have yourself a good time. People keep saying go to the dragon to get the dragon sword, but you're forgetting that you have to cut off the tail to get the dragon sword. <laughs> and the dragon, and this weapon does two damage, and you need to do a couple hundred. So, uh, nah, we ain't doing it. <laughs> ah, the sweet shot. It sings to me. <laughs> Oops, Daisy. There we go. What are we getting? About 500, about half k. All right. Do I have any poppables that kind of ease this burden? I feel like we do. How exactly is one meant to beat Madeir? Um, I mean, with determination, I guess. <laughs> he is hard. I'll give you that. My first go around was a really bad time. Like I hated him, but I think that's just because my build was really bad. Yeah, I think my I think my original build for that was just not suited for that, so. But uh try lightning. Lightning is good. Braden! Huzzah! You finally caught one of these live. How's everyone doing? Hope the run is going well so far. Everyone is doing it just fine. Chad has been having a lot of fun giving me weapons that are <laughs> not meant for my build, so that's but good. Uh but no, run is going great. Thanks for making it live and for your donation. Much appreciated. How's this run work? Basically, if I kill a boss, we get its weapon. Um the problem being is that I don't have the stats for most of them, so we have to uh, kind of find workarounds, usually. And I thought we were good, but uh, chat found an intelligence-based weapon for me to use, and that was, uh, that was a mistake on my part. So we're just kind of chillaxing and talking to chat a little bit for the time being. When is the SL1 New Game Plus? Oh, yeah, uh-huh. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, we ain't doing that. <laughs> Dark Souls is challenging, but you deal fixed one damage only. That's kind of where we're at, currently. Kind of where we're at. My claim to fame is patience. You've said so in several runs. This is true. Do you really think time requires an acceptable problem here? <laughs> All right, you caught me. I just wanted a reason to talk to Chad. You're right, you're right. The Gaping Dragon Axe is good. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That, uh... Well, I have a specific idea for that axe. I have a very specific purpose for that. I got finessed by chat. <laughs> Water or soda? Water, every time. Soda is bad for you. Don't drink it on repeat. Drink it at special occasions. Don't get me wrong, I love the flavor, but uh, it's just, it's too bad for me. I can't, I can't drink that. That and I've seen too many people get addicted to, uh, like, the sugar content, like, uh, especially with big ones like Mountain Dew. Oof. I have seen several people actually, like, legitimately get addicted to Mountain Dew. So, be careful. Okay, Dad! <laughs> That's it, go to your room! <laughs> oh, God. My opinion on Lobos Jr.? He's a fine man, a fine man. Now, of course... I don't know the man personally, I don't keep up with him, I haven't watched his videos in several years, but I will say back when Dark Souls 1 was like the only Dark Souls game we had, I loved watching his streams. Um, a lot of his streams do help me with some of my research for some of my runs. Um, the man is basically the aspiration for me. He is, uh, he is the original Patience Elemental, and I'm just hoping that I can kind of take over that mantle. But, but yeah good dude you're not a real dad <laughs> you can't tell me what to do <laughs> yeah 
How's life? Life is good. Life is busy. Life is very busy. But uh, life is good, though. I will not complain. Water is superior? Well, yeah, I mean, you know, 100% of living organisms on Earth need it, so it's got to be good, right? <laughs> but I'm already in my room. Good! <laughs> you know what you did. No. Do I know about Mitten Squad? I am aware of Mitten Squad. I don't watch his vids too often because he mostly focuses on Fallout. But, uh, oh, that did not work for some reason. Um, yeah, I don't watch his videos too often because he's mostly Fallout. But, uh, yeah, I've seen his videos. Personally, I feel like, uh, I don't know. Like, I like his videos a lot. Some of them are a bit much for me. But, uh, I can see the appeal. I can see the appeal. <laughs> Just five hours. Come on, Lemon. <laughs> it's only five hours. What weapon are we using? We're trying to use the Moonlight Spear, but uh, we need some more stats, so we're kind of just grinding out two more levels. Unless anyone has any uh, other places I can get some souls that, they, that I'm not thinking of, in which case let me know. You forgot the doll? Me too! <laughs> Have I ever played Hollow Knight? I briefly started it, but had to put it down due to time constraints. So, uh, yeah, that's where we're at, unfortunately. I'd like to. <laughs> Watching me live now in your office hiding the bus? Ah, I know the feeling. <laughs> Remember, make sure you keep on a serious face, that way they think you're actually not surfing Reddit. This is the part where you blow smoke, come on. There you go. Solaire has souls? Yeah. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> Chat? How many Solaires does- How many Solaires? How many souls does Solaire have? Asking for a friend. Asking for a friend. <laughs> Don't do it. No. <laughs> one. That's false. Not enough. 1.8. I mean, that's one point. That's three more runs I don't have to do. I don't know, guys. <sighs> the vids helped you play the first Dark Souls and now it's your favorite game. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm, I am both pleased and so sorry that I have done that to you. No, I'm, I'm glad you're enjoying it. How many more levels do I need? 2,000 more? Ugh, four more runs, okay. Almost there. Drops a negative 1,000, 100 souls. Man, so we're, so we're talking, he's dropping some, a good amount of souls then, huh? You can't take him? Oh, I don't need to take him. <laughs> I don't need to take him. I'm not taking him anywhere. One soul for every jolly cooperation in Dark Souls. So, that's a good amount then, huh? That's a good amount. Golden Eye 64, yeah, baby. Can we do five more hours of live? <laughs> Guys, I have things to do today. <laughs> Believe you me, I'd love to. If I could stream once a week all day, well, not all day, but if I could stream once a week for eight hours and like just be like, yeah, that'll do, I would. But alas, real life is uh, not so forgiving, unfortunately. Nestor? Bad Lemon, no attacking Sunbro this time. What do you mean this time? I've only attacked him once. Think about how many runs I've done in this game and how many times he's gotten away scot-free. The man owes me. Kill the Black Knight in the parish? I don't think we can lure him. Actually, you know. Oh, you might be onto something there. You might be onto something there. Alright, hold on. <laughs> hold on a minute. Justin might have just saved Solaire. <laughs> Justin might have just saved him. Let's let me get this level done here. I think I need a little bit more here. My favorite salt and sanctuary weapon? Uh the what's that dagger? Eviscerator. The eviscerator is my fave. Get the soul items on the bridge. I know, I know, they're there. Majora's mask? Yo yeah, baby! <laughs> what's my favorite souls game? Depends on what I want. Uh, for all around, I would probably just say Dark Souls 1. Because I know I get that question a lot, so... If you, if you really need a, a solid, simple answer, Dark Souls 1. <laughs> yes, kill the knights, just not me. <laughs> Solaire, I warned you. I told you you'd have to win chat to your side. You better work a little harder there. Alright, so here's what we're gonna do. Just ask him nicely for his souls. If he, he probably would give them to if you could. The first night, blast. Eh, the first black knight is 100% drop sword. No, he's not. 
It's a it's a percentage. None of the Black Knight weapons are are guaranteed drops. Okay. Oh, you know what? This is gonna be a little tricky because uh, we're on the wrong side here. Hmm. What? Uh, okay. All right. So you guys saw that, right? <laughs> You guys saw that too? <laughs> it's not, I'm not crazy. That was a thing. <laughs> All right then. Dragon Hornet, t t take take that one off. That one doesn't count. <laughs> Yeet! <laughs> Someone clip that. Oh my god. All right, well. That's the thing. Yeah, so I need to get to the other side of the bridge. What's oh, this, Pikmin? I can't tell if it's Pikmin or Patapon. I think it's Pikmin. Eh! <laughs> oh, 20 damage. We're getting somewhere. We're almost there. <laughs> Solaire's overrated. Let him perish. Nah, he's rated just fine. The only problem is now he's useful to me, so... We gotta... Kind of think about that. Oh, you... Clever girl. Ah. Up the ledge. Get off. There you go. And you. Go on. Go on. How? I just want to get eaten by rats. Let me do it. Thank you. Oh, it's Patapon? Okay. Wasn't 100% sure. No! Ah! <laughs> Alright, cool. That's fine. Everything's fine. Music fits? Yeah, right? Punch off its tail? Yeah, let me get right on that. <clears throat> okay, so if I go here, Dargan's gonna run away. But, if I remember correctly, if we leave the area and come back, it should... Keyword should... Come back? So let's do this. How am I just? Fuck. I don't know. All oh, this to save Solaire. I don't know. I don't know. You'd watch me play Patapon? I don't think I've ever. I have played Patapon before. It was interesting. It was unique. Which weapon is my favorite in Dark Souls 1? Uh, Astora? No. What's it called? The Astora Holy Sword or whatever it's called? The one down in. Uh, the Valley of Drakes. That one. A store straight sword, I think is what it's called. Oh, that's gonna be bad. Ow. We're running away. Is this banjo? Yeah, definitely banjo. <laughs> or, you know what? You're right, it could be Donkey Kong. They're made by the same maker, so that's why it's kind of hard. Kind of hard to tell. It's a solid faith early weapon early on. Exactly. <laughs> the ass! <laughs> yes, my favorite sword is the ass. You got me. Definitely rare wear music. Oh, it is. Okay. Have I ever played Outer Wilds? No, I have not. Alright, now we're definitely listening to Banjo. This is definitely Banjo. What about some secure videos? Hard to do a run on that. Every run is always the same. The only way to make it interesting would be to mod it, and I am not good enough at Sekiro to warrant any changes to the game. Alright. Just gonna dodge past all these guys. If they wanna out they wanna follow me all the way out, they're more than welcome to. Go, go. Control it. Hey! <laughs> God. Okay. Well, maybe that maybe that counts. <laughs> Grab Lord Trek set. Well, unfortunately, he's already run off, so we're struggling on that one. No game audio. No, there's game audio. It's just a little quiet. That's all. All right. Let's pretend that the dragon is there and he's more than happy to help me. Let's see what we can do. Uh, no, I've never played a Metal Gear Solid game. 
Or rather, I've never played any aside from the very, very first one. Like on the NES. Come on. Come on down, I've got good times for you. Whenever you're ready, though. There you go, that's the spirit. Come on down. Who's behind me? <laughs> Why are people behind me? No! Wait! Ah! <laughs> what is this nonsense? Oh, God. Okay, well, that's fine. This is fine. What am I trying to do? I'm trying to get souls. I need souls. I need one more level worth of souls. And honestly, this isn't feeling like it's worth it. It's too much effort. I'd rather just grind it again. Let's just grab a couple souls around. There's one. Ow. Thank you for that. That's a claymore. Can't do anything with that. I don't even think the... Nope, yeah, dragon is here. Okay. Alright, we got our dragon boy. He's back. Rest down here again. Oh, God. Okay. Let's go. Let's get on with this. All right. <laughs> so there's easier. I've done nothing wrong. No, you haven't. You are correct. But you are right there. Ow. And I hate to say it, but uh, sometimes being in the wrong place at the wrong time is just the way life goes, Solaire. <laughs> the community will crucify me. Yeah, what a... They've done it before. They could do it again. They'll be fine. Dragon Tail would have been easier. <laughs> With what? <laughs> Alright, buddy. I don't need your help later. I just need your help now. Do this for me, okay? <laughs> Whoa! Radical, dude. <laughs> I am a stubborn beast. Come on. Come on, Solaire. Attaboy. I'm real sorry about this, alright? No hard feelings. It's gonna hurt. No, it didn't hurt as much, nearly as much as I thought it would. Alright. Okay. Alright. Whoop! Hey, hanging in there, Solaire. Doing good, bud? S Solaire? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no. He outsmarted us. <laughs> oh no. Hmm. Aye. Uh, two Estes should be enough, I think. Solaire, pal. Reduced to ashes. <laughs> no. Uh oh. Uh oh. Ow. Damn it. Okay. <laughs> smart, smart lair. Oh, lordy. What's my favorite food? That's too big of a question. I don't know, man. I don't know, man. Sushi? I like sushi a lot. Sushi's good. That's what you get. I know. I know. Is the ladder open? Uh, yeah, the ladder is technically open. Oh, would he? You're right, he would just kind of oopsie-daisy off that, wouldn't he? You're right. Good idea, chat. Ow. Okay. Eh. Please stop burning me. Opinion on okra. Never had it. Can't say I've had it. Okay, let's go. <laughs> it seems that you, Lemon, were the one that were bamboozled. <laughs> yeah, I know. Solaire pulled a fast one on me. But the question is, is Solaire smart? If Solaire is smart enough to avoid dragon fire, is he smart enough to avoid ladder? The answer is, I don't know. So far, the answer is looking like, nope! <laughs> oh, so late. He only drops a thousand. Oh, <laughs> that's nothing. Oh, darn it. Oh, man. Well, 
This would be Sexy Solaire. At least Sexy Solaire is back on the menu. Not well. <laughs> Let's just have a moment of silence. Yeah, you're right. Sell this stuff to Frampt? I don't think it sells for very much. Solaire slipped and Element is innocent. Yes, thank you. <laughs> he just kept running. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, God. Oh, well. Sexy Party Solaire is a go. We're golden. As soon as my character wants to actually run forward. Now, granted, we are female, so this is a little different, but uh, it's fine. It's fine. We can we can work this. It'll make it work. All right. How many souls do I even need? I don't even know. What are we at? Ugh. Okay. Quite a few. Well, pop that. Let's get this party rolling. There's a couple more down the way, but I really don't want to go down there because I'm just gonna get mauled. So. All right, we got a few more. Got a few more grinds. <laughs> you feel betrayed. You should feel dead. Alright. Just level adaptability, bro. Almost there. <laughs> Taking shortcuts. We're gonna we're gonna make this as efficient as possible. We got this. What the hell are we listening to? <laughs> what is hold on one second. What are we listening to? Oh. This is, a uh, Killer Instinct. Okay. That's the thing. That's Rainbow Road again. Let's, uh, move somewhere different. Oh, there you go. Hey, there's some classics. For those of you that are- have been around on the channel for a long time... Get that mouse off the screen there. Uh... You might recognize this noise. Just maybe. He had a gravitational accident. <laughs> There's a lot of ways to sell that, say that someone fell off a cliff. Why don't I use Solaire's weapon? You make a solid point. You guys make a solid point. That is the rules. Them is the rules. Where's his sword? Oh, there it is. You know what? He didn't die for nothing. We can do it. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right. Technically, he wasn't an invader, so he doesn't count. He doesn't count. <laughs> you should not defy my equipment. <laughs> all right, fine, fine, fine. Butterfly horn. We'll stab things to death with the butterfly horn. I'm on it. I'm on it. It is a nice sword. It is a nice sword. Gunstar Heroes. Good stuff. You also didn't kill him. Oh, good point. <laughs> good point. Yeah, it's Gunstar Heroes. Mm -hmm. What is the faith requirement for his talisman? Um, survey says 14. 14. When's the Soul of Cinder fight? Uh, well, Soul of Cinder is Dark Souls 3, so this weekend. You'll get a Soul of Cinder fight this weekend. I heard this memory. <laughs> this misery. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Oh, boy. Okay. Time to level Faith instead of Intelligence, then? No, 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 no. <laughs> because the screen is blurry. <laughs> It's weird, every time I kill Solaire, I get, like, allergies. It's really bad. Like, both my eyes start tearing up. It's weird. Yeah, there we go. Almost there. 82.14, okay. 82.14. Left hand only run? Nah. Nah. Don't need it. Riveting stream here. Oh, I know. <laughs> well, chat did this. Chat has no one to blame but themselves. <laughs> Dark Souls 2 gun game would be fantastic? I haven't even thought about that. God, that would be a thing. That one would be tricky. 
considering that, um, one, I don't think I have a mod for that. Um, I'd have to check on that. But uh, also, on top of that, that game is very much spokes in a wheel. Unlike Dark Souls 1, where it's like, yeah, you just go where you want, you know? Like, we can sequence break the hell out of Dark Souls 1. Ow. Um, but it's a little tricky for Dark Souls 2. You've got, like, five directions to go, and that's it. So, you'd have to kind of balance out the spokes. Which would be interesting. That would be interesting. And Lord knows they give you enough souls in that game, so you could definitely probably make most of the weapons work. I'll think about it. Crossbow only run's going to be lit. Is lit a good thing? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Um, why does all the young people keep telling me to light myself on fire? I don't understand. Bunch of pyromaniacs this generation. Um, yeah, it's, it is it is uh, hopefully going to be a good time. I certainly had a good time with the video. So, uh, yeah. Hope you guys enjoy it. We deserve it for picking the spear. Yeah. See, we're all we're all we're all to blame here. <laughs> it's everyone's fault. It's everyone's fault at this point. Eh. All right. What we got? I think this is it. I think that is the last of it. Memory serves. Yep. We're there. All right. So put it into resistance. No, I'm just kidding. All righty. Ooh. Ooh, the music just kicked in. It knows. All right, what am I doing here? Capra. It's Capra time. Mm -mm. Oh, yeah. Sewer surfing. Jack, thank you so much for the lemon emote. <laughs> I'm not sure what's happening in that picture. It looks like I'm getting peeled, but... Uh, definitely feels appropriate. Ow, 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 ow. What happened there? Oh god! Fight the Hellkite? No! <laughs> We're not doing that. We're going. Capper has a weapon? He sure does. He's got himself a big old hatchet I want. How do you peel a lemon? Carefully. Very carefully. <laughs> Demon Machete. What is this song? This song is called Sewer Surfing. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I forget which game. I think tur number four? Turtles in Time? Resistance only run? Are you trying to make Blight Town easy for me? Let's go. Test it out. That'll do. Decent enough damage. I am going the wrong way. <laughs> I just realized it. Where am I going? But we can get the dragons gone though, so we can actually get there safe. Huzzah! Alucard! Thank you so much for joining. Enjoy your emotes. Enjoy the wallpaper. Welcome to the club. The butterfly horns thing is its intense range. Absolutely. One of the longer spears. It's also another good thing about it that a lot of people forget is that it also has straight up magic damage. So anything that has like any kind of physical resistance, just poke it with the butterfly spear, melts like butter. Did I play Call of Duty BO1? Uh, the fact that I have to even think about what that is is uh, probably good. Oh, Black Ops. That's Black Ops. Uh, yeah, I played that back when it came out. I had free time back then. Didn't like it. Call of Duty games are kind of meh for me. Just kind of, I don't know. It's one of those games where it's like kind of an artificial difficulty, so you have to play it on normal or just die repeatedly, which is not very fun. And then the multiplayer aspect of those games doesn't work for me because as someone who doesn't have time, um, any game that has competitive multiplayer where you get more power the longer you play, I simply can't compete. Ooh, nice. Like, I just, I just don't have the free time to compete with that, so it's just not gonna happen. Zombies? Yeah, zombies was a good time. That's where I spent most of my time. <laughs> a butterfly spear cuts things like butter. Well, stabs things like butter. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> Pleasure to be here. Took me too long to join? Oh. Never too long. Never too long. 
You join on your own time. I hold. The only requirement of this channel is if you're here, I just hope you're enjoying yourself. That's really the only thing I need. Everything else is extra. Speaking of extra, if you want a Tony shirt, check the link above. <laughs> I'm obligated to say something every once in a while. Because today's the last day, so if you don't get them now, they're gone. But yeah, no, honest, like, in all honesty, don't get me wrong. Every little bit helps. All the donations and the shirt purchases and all that inches me closer to just being, like, you know, financially stable through YouTube, which is awesome. Um, can't wait. But, uh, at the same time, life is hard. And I understand people have their own things they're going through, so never feel obligated to spend money on the channel. Only if you can and only if you want to. Alright. So we're already seeing the benefit of the spear. And that is the long range. It should help with these dogs, considering they're a one-hit kill. All we have to do is not die here. Theo, thank you so much for joining. Enjoy those emotes. Severe lack of Mega Man OSTs. Yeah, that would have been that would have been the uh, the meta gamer move right there. We're fine. We're fine. Don't do it, dogs. Aha, I tricked you. Oh god, hell, hi everyone. Alright, dogs are dead. <laughs> uh, that worked. I want your weapon. Poke, poke, ah. Oh, poke. <laughs> what are you gonna do, buddy? I outdistance you. Fight an enemy you cannot reach. So yeah, this is, uh, this is a plus zero sword with minimal intelligence or sword a plus zero spear with z uh, zero intelligence requirements or uh, not intelligence requirements but like I have nothing above the base requirement so you can see how good it's doing now you can only imagine how good it does later if you actually have a magic build just saying don't sleep on it alrighty we did it chat it only took like an hour but we did it <laughs> <laughs> now let's see. We need to. Un momento, por favor. Switch on over. One like butterfly. And because we've killed Capra. Let's see, what is that called? The demon's machete, I want to say. I think if I type in machete, we should get it. Nope. Alright, who's got the name for me? What is it called? Someone fill me in so I don't have to look it up myself. Great machetes. Great demon machete. Ah, that's, that's why. Great demon. No. Demon great machete. Come on, guys. <laughs> Come on, guys. There we go. All right. One, two, three. There it is. 40 strength. Man, we can almost one-hand it. How about that? Almost one-hand it. Brayden. Welcome to the Orange Files so much. Alright, so we've got a big old swing, and we've got a whatever the hell that is. Cool. <laughs> dual wield. No dual wielding in Dark Souls. Doesn't work. Alright, next up. It's, uh... I... Hmm. We're gonna go slightly out of order. We're gonna go slightly out of order here. We're gonna head down this way. Eh. Give Tony my regards. Yeah, this is a good weapon. It's pretty good. <laughs> this this will do. But because I have plans, a multitude of plans, we are not going to go after gaping just yet. Oh man, that bot again! He is really persistent. I always hate when they do that. They always come up with new phrases that the uh, chat can't seem to chat can't seem to pinpoint and remove. It's a shame. But is it big enough? Yeah, it's big enough. <laughs> It'll be fine. Oof, cord. That's a <laughs> that's a dad joke right there. Gaping dragon weapon would be great against the iron golem. It would. 
but then you you're forgetting that then I have to have a go the iron golem weapon which I think you see the problem <laughs> I'm sure you can see the problem at that point kill stray demon um we could kill a stray demon the question with the stray demon is that it doesn't have a uh, doesn't have a weapon so we might have to he's just kind of free souls So we could go kill him. We do need the, we do need the, what do you want to call it? The doll. Let me, uh, let me rest real quick and then we'll, we'll go ahead and do that. Ban the word love. Yeah, you know. <laughs> no weapon equals fists? No, no, we've been kind of just holding on to it. Doesn't it have an axe? No. No, you're thinking of the asylum demon. It has a hammer. But, uh, yeah, the Asylum Demon has a hammer, but we've already gone through that one. We did that already. Has a Demon Catalyst? No, no, no. You think the Demon Catalyst comes from the Fire Sage. You guys are mixing them up, which is understandable, considering they're all, all three of them look exactly the same. But, uh, you know. Hey, Index. Hope you're doing well there, bud. Thanks for stopping by. Appreciate you. Okay, let's see here. Let's... you Chad is right. Let's go ahead and go kill the stray demon real quick so we can have the doll for later. But, uh... But we have other plans. We have other plans. Use the catalyst to bonk. I don't know. We've got a couple, uh... We've got 14 intelligence. I'm sure we can do something with that, right? Am I allowed... Am I required to cut off the tail? Nah. Nah, nah. We just spawned it in. It's okay. You can't equip the Titanite slab. <laughs> no, I, unfortunately I cannot. Don't have that mod just yet. <clears throat> oh, boy. Brayden, again, with the donations. Thank you. It's almost like having a bunch of reskins get confusing or something. I know, right? <laughs> Who'd have thought? Who would have thought? Hmm. Ah, that's better. I've heard I've heard Elden Ring has a similar problem, but uh, we'll find out later. One, two, three. And there we go. Easy. Yeah, I don't really need that key for this run. We'll be okay on that regard. Since we've already done Blight Town, so let's just uh, let's just hang hang out here for a bit. Ah, boy. Ah, uh, don't worry about it, Index. Don't worry about it, man. <clears throat> Woo! Been talking for too long. Not a problem. The fact that you are uh, just uh, here at the stream is more than enough. Elden Ring's problem is on a much bigger scale. Yeah, we'll find that out when we finally get around to it. Did I beat the booba lady? I did. She was actually, I think, the second boss I killed. Yeah, get on out of here. Oh, it's more Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. All right. So good, we wanted it twice. Ow. All right. All right, all right. Well, that's fun. Cool. <laughs> I'm just going to run past these guys. That would have been smarter. Bro, man. Name checks out. Name checks out. We've only died 16 times. Is that right? <clears throat> that's crazy. Solaire, thanks for joining. Much appreciated. Sorry we had to kill you, but, uh, you know, it is what it is. Wolf ring would help? Eh. Eh. Any ring would help at this point, let's be real. <laughs> What's my favorite boss in Elder Ring? Wouldn't know. I've killed about five of them. And that's it. Please give us your playlist. Um, I believe I've dropped the playlist in the Discord at one point or another. So if you go there and kind of search for playlist, I'm sure it'll pop up. But uh, if not, what I can do is I'll put that in the frequently asked questions section of the Discord as well. I can do that. Because I've had a couple people ask for it. Torchal's the most dangerous enemy? For sure. <laughs> Should count as a boss. If he dropped torches, I'd think about it. Why no armor? I like going fast. 
Gotta go fast. You know how it goes. You're surprising the Asylum Re Yeah, Asylum Revisit is definitely another one of those hidden areas where are just like, who figured that out? Give that person a medal, because I don't know how they figured it. So, you like walls, eh? Oh, God. Okay, well, that backfired immediately. Ow! Okay. Ow! Jesus! <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. We're gonna have to, uh, have to run. How does one access the Discord? There should be a link in the description, I do believe. Um, and if it's not there, it'll be in any other video I've put up. So just uh, grab that link and type it in. You'll be good to go. Should be fine. Havel's ring? Nah, not yet. I would need to reel the dra- Yeah, I would have to kill. No, no, wait, we've decided. Invaders count as many bosses, but uh, just regular NPCs do not. So no, I wouldn't have to use the uh, dragon tooth. Is it hard? Is hard difficulty good for a beginning of Bioshock first playthrough? Uh, I would stick to normal. I would stick to normal, but that's just me. I'm also not very good at first-person shooters. Dragomir! First time catching a stream, looking forward to the next video? Well, I hope you enjoy it. Should be coming out this weekend if all goes well. Once again, I have a very busy weekend this weekend. Uh, I'll be out of town, but I am bringing my work laptop with me, just in case. Just in case something weird happens and I don't finish the video by the time I leave town. So, we'll, we'll see. But I'm hoping to get it out by Saturday. Um, actually, I have to get it out by Saturday. <laughs> the sponsor requires it, so, uh, yeah. Coming out this weekend. Is this game easy? No. No. It's not hard if you know what you're doing or if you you know, think and don't treat it like a button masher. Um, but it's also, good lord. But also, as you can see, it is definitely not the easiest game on the block. Uh, just due to damage and other problems. And it's a little clunky. So, you know. That gets in the way sometimes, too. But yes, um, Leon is right. It is very learnable. <laughs> Use a shield. Unlike me. Don't do what I, don't do what I do. Do as I say, not as I do. Sit down. Okay. We made it. First things first, let's go get the doll before I forget. What does a boss weapon gun mean? Oh, so gun mode, or gun game rather, is a um, is a mode in Counter-Strike where when you kill something, you get their weapon. Or you get, or I guess in that game nowadays, it's more like you kill them and now you get the upgraded version of the next weapon. So in this one, if I kill a boss, I get their weapon. Eh, I wanted to hit you, but I guess we're gonna not do that today. Ow. Okay, well. I can't one-hand it, so parrying's kind of out of the question here. New plan! Run- ow! Run away! <laughs> I'm just here to collect my things! Almost there, almost there, there we go. Haha! -ha. Later. Would a run like this be possible in Sultan Sanctuary? Um, considering I have access to the debug menu, it would. It absolutely would. Um, the problem, of course, would be that when you don't have the strength, like the right requirements, you also do terrible damage there too. But yes, actually, someone recently pointed out how to get around that problem. So yeah, we could totally do this in Sultan Sanctuary. That'd be a fun revisit. That'd be fun. I didn't forget the doll. I got the doll. Please tell me I got the doll. <laughs> there it is. Okay, good. You guys drive me nuts over here. New plan. Survive. Alright. Hello, stray demon. Please don't do that. Don't be rude. Don't be that guy. Oh, you're gonna do it anyway. Okay. He bravely ran away. <laughs> For my name is Sir Robin. This damage is not as good as I was hoping. I'm a little alarmed. Oh, what? Okay, come on now. Uh, okay, I thought that was the burst again. Come on, get out of here. 
Do I play Resident Evil? No, not particularly. I have played 4, which was a great game. I played 2 back when it came out. Um, I played 5 with my brother, which was a good time. That game needs co-op. And then uh, I played 6 through and put it down from there. <laughs> 6 was not good. 6 was not good at all. Um, but And then now the new ones that have come out, Village and all that other one, um, they look really good. I'm glad they went back to the basics. But uh, holy crap, that is not... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I am terrible at horror games. Like, I do, I get spooked. So, uh, they did too good a job, if you know what I mean. Come, come here, just give me your tail. There you go. <laughs> we just need more strength. Oh, is that all we're missing? <laughs> we're we're kind of maxing out on strength, guys. I don't know if we can... I don't know if we can really get any more. What we need is to upgrade the weapons, but uh, that ain't gonna happen either. More stamina would also be good, yeah. But I don't trust chat, so I kind of have to pour into the other stats first before we can pour into things like health and stamina. We're doing fine, though. It's fine. It's just slow. Just slow. It's a nice showcase. We're just showcasing the weapon, that's all. Oh, come on now. Oh, come on now. Alright. Imagine there's a comically large spoon. We talk about salt and sanctuary because there is. <laughs> they beat you to it. <clears throat> Ugh, God, my throat. I forgot my tea. Oh God. <clears throat> Come on. Take your lumps. I'm weird about horror. Like, when it comes to horror, I like horror books. I will read the hell out of horror books. I love them so much. Uh, and horror movies are kind of hit or miss for me. Mainly because nowadays it seems like most of them rely on jump scares, which is just cheap. Uh, but I'll take a thriller or like a horror thriller any day. Those are always a good time. But you put me in the seat, <laughs> put me in a first person view that I can't escape. And, uh, yeah, no, I'm out. That's that's when it gets me. Will I play Salt and Sacrifice? I have, repeatedly. I've actually platinumed a bit. Platinumed it. But, um, yeah, I just, this week, this month was a really bad month for, uh, challenge runs of games that I was unfamiliar with. So, I don't, I don't know if you noticed, but, like, I kind of, I had to, oh, this is going to hurt. Oh, come on. Okay, we're fine. Uh, this month I kind of stuck to things I knew, um, with, uh, Dark Souls 1, uh, Dark Souls 3 is coming out this weekend, and then, uh, just two shorter, relatively shorter games on top of that. So, but, uh, yeah, didn't really have time for a longer game, and Salt and Sacrifice can be longer, uh, if you, <laughs> if you're doing a challenge run, as I have so very quickly learned. Um, there we go, straight demon down. Easy peasy. Easy peasy. Hardest soul game? I'd argue Dark Souls 1, just because uh, the mechanics are a little sh are a little rough. What does take your lumps mean exactly? Uh, <laughs> it means if you want to be part of the club, you gotta take your lumps. This is Castlevania, yeah. This is Castlevania music. It's just it's just how it goes. So. <laughs> If you want to be part of the Lemon Gang, yeah, take your lumps, that's all. Alright, oh, what are you two doing? Get out of here. You were supposed to jump down and get blown up, that's that's where it was supposed to go. Alright, so. Oh, let me look at my, um... My list here. As far as strength weapons go, the hardest one we have to deal with is Smo's Hammer. I know you guys are gonna freaking give me. Um, looks like dexterity pretty much maxed out at 18, so we're good there. And then intelligence and intelligence and uh, holy or faith rather tended to max out around 18 as well. So we need to account for that. 
because that's going to be a problem later. That is going to be a problem now. Um, all right, what do we need to get rid of? <clears throat> what do we need to be worried about? Smo. What do we need to worry about that? <coughs> oh crap! <coughs> That's better. Hmm. Excuse me, got something in my throat today. Am I gonna play the DLC? I'm gonna certainly try. I don't think I'm gonna get that far today. <coughs> oh man! Hold on one second. There we go. All right, got the thing on my throat. Sorry about that. Okay. Uh, yeah, we're gonna try and do the DLC, but I think we're probably not gonna get much further today. I imagine we'll get past Ornstein and Smo, and maybe into one or two of the Lord bosses, but that's about it. All right, so with that in mind, let's focus on getting that strength up. Let's focus on you guys not screwing me over there. And now, time for the golem. And I seem to have lost chat when I did that. I have to fix that. Oopsies. Oh, guys, come on now. Everyone, chill out. Everyone be cool. Everyone be cool. There we go. All right, all right, all right, all right. Quiet phone. All right, we are back. Let me fix one thing real quick my end. There we go. Uh, nope. There we go. Okay, cool. Move right along. We need to get to our boy. Andre. That's, what, that's his name. Took me a minute. <laughs> Smose hammer is your vote. Don't you worry. You'll get your vote. Moonlight Greatsword is 28 intelligence. I don't remember if it's 28 or 24. I have written down... What do I have written down here? Uh, Seath. I have 24 written down. So I think that's probably it. Do Nito for the thumbnail? Yeah, he'll probably be our first hit. We'll get him. This sounds like skeleton music. It's actually, uh... Is it Gremlin? It's actually Gremlin's music, if you can believe it. You're forgetting my souls? Leave them. Leave them. They're fine. Don't need them. <laughs> Guys, remember that time with the butterfly spear? <laughs> we need you to agree on Ornstein's spear. I think we're okay for Ornstein. <gasps> no, we're not. Oh, no. Okay, I stand corrected. I need to pour points into dexterity. <laughs> That's 24. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, we can't have that. Okay. Here we go, here we go. 24, you use it? Yeah, see, there, I thought so. I thought so. Yeah, we're gonna need more decks. Okay, well. Let me grab a few things while I'm here, then. We're gonna need those later. Gentlemen. Gremlins 2 on the NES. There you go. There you go. And right now we're listening to some Assassin's, 2, Assassin's Creed 2 music. I recognize it. Just gonna wiggle my way around you. Thank you. How many weapons have we gotten up till now? Uh, probably about seven. I want to say, give or take. Whoa. Okay. Hello. Oh. Okay. Hello. We're just. Everyone's here, huh? Yes. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> yep. That feels about right. Cool. Thanks. Iron Golem Axe next? Well, it could be the Golem Axe, or it could be the Fists. Hard to say. Can I switch weapons? No. No. My, uh, the weapon I have in my hands is changing every time we get a new weapon. So I can't go back. Brayden! Maybe the greatest boss weapon was the friends we made along the way. I mean, to be fair, anytime chat has any say on how a run goes, chat is the greatest boss. Absolutely true. For sure. Chat just, uh, you know, I don't blame them. It's kind of the whole thing this channel is kind of based on, but uh, chat really likes to watch me suffer. So, uh, <laughs> personally, I don't get it. You know, I'm, I'm the kind of guy that's like, no, I want to see content. Like, 
take a cool weapon and use it. And that'd be cool, but uh, <laughs> Chad is not that. Chad is Chad is definitely not that guy. Or at least more often than not, anyway. But such is life. Ah! <laughs> ah, that was worth it. Oop. Okay. Uh, you fool! You'll kill us both. Ah, damn it. Come on. Come on. Give him his just desserts. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Which is better, the axe or the fists? Honestly, I could not tell you. I wish I could tell you, but I just don't know. They're both pretty bad. Your suffering is our content. That's fair. That's fair. <laughs> I don't care. Eh, I care a little bit. I care a little bit. Still worth it? Yeah, you know. I thought it was funny. That late boulder kill. That's right. Still counts. Alright. At least you didn't make me do the darkest dungeon run. You know, as awful as that run would be, I do admit it would be terrible. But at the same time, I am curious. Like, I am really curious. I thought more people would be. But, uh... I guess I just underestimated how many Dark Souls fans I have in my community. I will say, I did start doing, like, a Plague Doctor only run. Like, uh, just, you know, a whole team of Plague Doctors instead of just one singular hero. Um, the, uh... While the content itself, I can see why people are like, no, that's just boring. It's like, well, yeah, I mean, a little, like, but I'm not going to show you every single fight, you know? Like, it's going to be, when I make the content, it's going to be, uh, more akin to, like, how I do where I just kind of jump between bosses and stuff and anything cool that happened. And I will say, uh, it has been wildly entertaining since I named everybody, like, Mrs. Lemon, Mac, Carl, and Lemon. Uh, it has been endlessly entertaining to... <laughs> See the antics that Carl's been getting up to. That man. I don't... I don't know. It's been pretty fun. So, I'll still make a video in the in the end, but, uh, but yeah. Would I do this on Dark Souls 3? Yeah, sure, I'd give this a run. I'd give this a try on the other Dark Souls series. I'll probably make a video about this eventually. Uh, it'll be a, it'll be a ways off, but, uh... One day I'll probably make this into a video, and we'll see if people like it. And if they really like it, then uh, we can do uh, Dark Souls 2 and 3. What's the Darkest Dungeon Run? The one that I'm currently working on, I have two. Just kind of on the back burner. Uh, one is just straight up just all Plague Doctors, so all four heroes are Plague Doctors. Uh, which is the closest I can get to a Firebomb run for Darkest Dungeon. Although someone said there's some sort of Arsonist class, which I looked into. They don't have just fire bombs or anything like that, so it's it's not quite close. Uh, but the other challenge run I had planned, got my way, uh, was a singular hero run. So just just one, like not one class, one hero. Uh, and that uh, that is a challenge. I'll tell you what. Caleb, thank you so much for your donation. My videos make your day ten times better. Well, I appreciate that. I really do. Thanks for stopping by and saying and saying so. And Bronson, bleed for our pleasure, O oh Citadel Gladiator. <laughs> Profit from our Shunthrod. Shadenthrod, excuse me. Have a dose of your blood money. <laughs> well, thanks. I guess that's fair. I guess I I guess I earn the suffering, huh? One way or another. I think many people who played Salt and Sanctuary have also played a Dark Souls game. This is true. This is true. Uh, a whole type, a whole one type of only person run sounds more doable. It is, it absolutely is. Um, so, like with with that, I've gotten actually kind of far. Whereas with the one hero run, I'm still kind of figuring it out. Still kind of figuring it out. Out of all Dark Souls games, what's my fave? Dark Souls One. In case you couldn't tell, that's not possible. I disagree. I disagree. And if you know anything about this channel. Uh, <laughs> you you would know that uh, my favorite saying whenever someone goes no 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 you can't do that it's uh well ye of little faith 
guess you'll guess we'll see you in the video. <laughs> Striker. Thank you so much for that donation. Much appreciated. Seems totally impossible. It does. It does. But, uh... That's where you're wrong, kiddo. <laughs> or at least I think so. We'll see. We'll see. Worst case scenario, I am wrong, and we get a video out of it. And you guys get some, you know, some cool content, and uh, you get to learn how hard it is. So, at the very least, you won't make the same mistakes I do. Some sort of dungeon, darkest dungeon Nuzlocke? You mean darkest dungeon in general? <laughs> no, no. Uh, it would just be a singular hero. That's it. Uh, I get one hero to fight every enemy and every boss. And uh, I will have to make a few allowances like I did in XCOM where one hero... Like, I get to use a couple for sacrifices to kind of pass time when I need to. But for the most part, uh, just one hero doing all the work. All right. Dark Souls while over 100%. People keep suggesting that. I don't think you understand how bad of a video or run that would be. <laughs> it's That would be really bad. So, uh, gonna give that the hard pass. Trying to go in any particular order? I do have a route, which I have kind of foregoed at this point, but uh, we're getting there. Oh man. Voice damage. Alright, so I need to get you a little closer to the edge, if you would. Because I'd rather knock you off the edge. Pick up that drop from the Boulder Knight? No! <laughs> Can't make me. I don't need it. It does nothing for me. If you want it so bad, go get it yourself. <laughs> Ow! Oh, okay. Womp womp. Don't think I saved at the bonfire? I'm pretty sure I did. I'm pretty sure I did. Oh, damn it. You're right. Well, that's fun. Okay. <laughs> Earned that one. Where were you five minutes ago? <laughs> oh, God. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I'm pretty sure I did. Famous last words. Yeah, no kidding. That's okay. That's okay. Just means we get to listen to more music. It's all good. I forgot the bonfire! <laughs> Story of my life. Alright. Run, run, run. Run, run, run. Oh god, you're late. Yes, you are. <laughs> yes, you are. And depending on my voice, we're going to either go for another 20 minutes or so, or another hour. But I hate to say it, but it's kind of leaning towards another 20 minutes. Just because, uh... My voice is dying on me, and I kind of need it for voice recording later. So... Where is it? Where is it? Okay, fine, I'm going. Jesus. Go, go, go. What's my favorite Dark Souls 1 boss or bosses? Uh, Dark Souls 1? Oh, that's a tricky one. Not sure. Not sure. I guess, like, Artorius or Manus, probably. If I had to guess. It's a monster hunter weapon. Yeah, it's pretty close to a great sword. Yeah, yeah, it's definitely on, definitely on par. Any particular tips for a pair of new players to Dark Souls? Uh, well, if you are playing on console, play together. It will make the game much more fun and much more enjoyable for you, uh, or easy, I should say. Um, but if not, don't be afraid to use a shield, and uh, try not to fat roll. If you can avoid using heavy enough armor to, like, just kind of mid-roll or even light roll, you'll be fine. And other than that, just kind of play it how you want. Should be okay. Brayden! 
Your health is important, my man. Take a rest if you need it. We wouldn't want to see you go hollow. <laughs> well, it's not my health. It's not my health. It's just that after talking for a long period of time, because I don't normally talk very much throughout the day, um, after a stream, my voice tends to be kind of eh. But uh, that's okay. I have other things I need to do for the video. I still need to cut it up and finish the script uh, and just kind of get that going. So I could do all that today instead. So it's all good. And I could just do voice recording in the morning tomorrow. But I appreciate your concern. All right, you all saw me sit down this time, right? <laughs> do I need a cough mint? No, I need, a, I need tea. I need some throat coat tea. That'd be nice. JoJo's music? No, this is actually uh, Button Smasher, or Button Masher, excuse me. Uh, he's a YouTuber, and he makes a lot of video game 8-bit uh, music. Really talented dude. Very kind enough. He's super kind. He likes to... I've asked him multiple times if I can, if he's okay with me using his music, and he's all about it. So long as I kind of, you know, promote it in the uh, description, which we always do. So, uh, yeah, if you like what you're hearing, he's got some really cool stuff. Feel free to give him a look. Glad to see me live for once. It happens. It happens. I'm hoping to start going live at least once a week. I'd like to do that. Uh, but life so far has not allowed for that. So we're going live whenever we can. All right. How do you make your scripts? I write them. <laughs> no. Um, basically, I'll complete a run. And then I will scrub through all of my footage. Finding moments that I think are, uh... Ooh, that's a good damage right there. Or, some good poise damage. I like that attack. That's a cool attack. I'll we'll work with that. Uh, but I'll, uh, scrub through all my footage. Ow. And if I find a moment that's worth talking about, or just a moment that really encapsulates something I want to talk about, then it goes in. I make a mental note of the time code. And, uh, say what I want to say. You are not really giving me what I need for this whole falling off the ledge thing, bud. I need you to turn a little bit more. Oh, I think he turned a little too much. Find out in a minute. Come on. Come on. Do it for chat. You can do it. I believe in you. Or we can just take our... Oh, man. The damage is too low? Jeez. That's not good. What does that say? What does that say about this weapon, huh? Woo! Oh well, at least we can win normally. Seeing as he's not too hard of a boss. Alright. What if I did a challenge run with Dark Souls without Estus? Eh, nah. Oh man, if I could, if I could get him! Golden, but my stamina is just too slow. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> hey, got him. Nice, 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 nice. Okay. Well, chat, we have a choice to make. We have a choice to make, ladies and gentlemen. Bronson. Our lemon, who art in Lordran, hallowed be thy name. Thy kindling come, <laughs> kindling come, thy will be done on earth as it is in Lordran. Praise the firebomb. And all that jazz. Okay. Who's ready? Who's ready? We are gonna have us a nice little pull. We've got about two more bosses left before this stream goes, goes the way of the, the dinosaur. Which weapon? We've got fist, or we've got axe. Make it happen. Make it happen, chat. Oh, boy. Do, 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 do. <laughs> ah, shit, it looks like we're going fist. <laughs> Alright, well, that's fine. That's fine. 
You have done it with the firebomb, but it has too many syllables for the meter. Or, yeah, no, I know what you're talking about. You did good. You did good. Never seen the fist before? Do that one. Okay. All right. Well, vote with your money. And by money, I mean just, you know, normally. <laughs> just, just, just click the button. It's free. Oh, God. Um, just business stuff on the phone. Don't care about that. Okay. Don't care about that right now. Well, Chad, I hate to say it, but it looks like we're going... <laughs> I think it's a safe bet is fist. I think it's a safe bet to say we're going fist. But before I sign off on that uh, that poll there, uh, don't forget, <laughs> vote with your mouse, not your keyboard. <laughs> yeah, there you go. That's the way it goes. Um, but yeah, no. Uh, before we sign off on this poll, uh, don't forget, uh, if you want that t-shirt, gotta say, um, it's right there. It's at the top of the top of the chat there. If you haven't dismissed it, go ahead and give that a look. If it's if it suits your fancy, make sure you grab it before the end of today because it's gone after that. So, anywho, I think that's long enough. It's at 69%. <laughs> oh, it just dropped to 68. Ah, darn. Who ruined that? Who's my hero? <laughs> Who's the hero that ruined that? Okay. Well, that's. Oh, look, of course, there's a, uh, <laughs> the Check Me Out channel giving us the poll theme, one song too late. Way to go. Okay. Anywho. Take that off. Swing on down to, where's my weapons? Uh, there it is, Demon Great Machete. And we have the Bone Fist. Dra I think it's Dragon Bone Fist, is that right? Nope. Shoot. All right, who's got it? Dragon Bone Fist? There it is. Okay, I got it. We got it. We're safe. Uh, uh oh. All right. Dark Souls says no. <laughs> Ooh, and memento. Let me just uh, close out of Dark Souls for a hot second and uh, pop right back in. It did not like that. Go figure. Uh oh. Uh oh! <laughs> Task manager. Bring out the big guns. There we go. That's better. Okay. Let's try that again. Dun, 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 dun. It's so cool, Max, then. <laughs> no, we we got it. We got it. While we, while we wait for the screens to pop through. Who wants a little bit of Tony? You want some Tony? I want Tony. Boop. There you go. Everybody happy. Everybody's happy. Alright, let's see. Maybe it worked. Maybe it worked. We have... No, it did not work. Okay, let's try it again. Uh, where'd it go? Where did it go? God, music's good though, huh? I'm not complaining about the music, that's for sure. One second. Gotta reopen the mod. There we go. Okay. One. Highlights. Item replacer. There we go. And dragon bone fist. Replace. There it is. All right, we're good. What is this stupid thing? Decent damage because it wow scales really good with our strength, so that's good. Durability is through the roof. Uh, but the wheat is kind of silly. But hey. We can do this! Sure you can! <laughs> Alright, let's go. Let's go. Let's go this way. Yep. Working as intended. And if I could... quickly get rid of these souls... 
into something a bit more useful, I think that would be beneficial. Let's see. Make sure chat can't ruin me too much. That should be enough safety net. Okay. Oh, well, let's take the fast way down. Where is it? Oh, it's down the way. Down the way. Hold on a minute. Let's walk around those. Head on down here. Go, go, go. Oh, crap. Okay. Eh. Got my way. Got my way. No, get out of the way! <laughs> get out of the way! <laughs> Please! <laughs> okay, thank you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! <laughs> yeah! Okay. That's great. <sighs> yep. That's a thing. <laughs> we did it, chat. We did it. Alright, if we could just actually roll this time. There we go. Problem solved. Okay. Where am I? Got that guy coming for me. You know what? Screw it. I want this. Thank you. Worth it. <laughs> I stepped on the only Lego brick here. <laughs> oh my god, yeah. Gravity, the final boss. Alright. Alright. Almost there. We'll get it. We'll get it eventually. Ah, my ring. I forgot to put on my ring. There we go. Haha, -ha, I have glowy feet. No one can stop glowy feet. Look how good look how good the glowy feet are. Yeah! Run away. <laughs> please don't shoot me, please don't shoot me, please don't shoot me. Uh. Right, we're good. We're good. We're okay. You quit Dark Souls 1 because of the moonlight butterfly? Well, I won't make fun of you, but I will tell you that it's optional. So, you know, if uh, <laughs> if that's your only qualm about it, you can go back. It's safe. Is upgrading in the rules? It's allowed. You know, it's it's fine. But, um, but uh, yeah, I don't think I have any Titanite or anything. Because this requires Demon Titanite, and I have not been picking stuff up. So, yeah. Not exactly going to help us. He was optional. <laughs> he, yeah, sorry. <laughs> you did not have to kill him. Is this a no armor run? It might as well be. This is just how I play games. I don't know if you've noticed with all my videos, but I don't tend to wear armor. AJ, Lemon Challenge Run in Dishonored? Um, you know, I've played through that game once. And I don't really remember it. So, I'd have to think about... I'm going to change the music real quick. Apologies for the... Uh, apologies for the, the change in scenery there. Let's see. A lot of Nintendo music. Let's see if we can skip through that a little bit. Okay, alright. Alright, I'm going to help you out there. Playlist, give me a second. Let's, uh, let's do this. There you go. That's better. That's better. Alright, anyway. Uh, but yeah, I haven't played through that game in a long time, so I'd have to probably look at it a little more and see what would even be considered a challenge run. So, yeah. What am I using to add weapons to my inventory? A mod. It's uh, the item switch mod, so it lets me take whatever item I have and turn it into something else. Iron Golem weapons need Dragon Scales. Oh, good. Even worse. <laughs> That's something we definitely don't have. Eh. <laughs> oh, good. It's the Cestus run all over again. Eh. <laughs> Alright, well, I was gonna let you live. But now, I don't think so. And just for that, I'm gonna treat your buddy to a Hadouken. Wonk. <laughs> Alright, that was pretty cool. <laughs> 
That was pretty cool. Alright. Dishonored is sick. Like I said, it's been a long time. I haven't played it since it came out. Mod, aka Cheat Engine. I mean, technically, you're not wrong. It's a, it's a script on Cheat Engine, so... Take that for what you will. Let's top off. Why did I kill Solaire? Uh, it sped up run. It sped up the run a little bit. We needed the souls and such. Okay. Would I consider doing a cleaning up Lordran challenge? Is that the one where you don't die and you don't load in anything, so you have to kill every enemy? It's a little tricky, as Lobos Jr. figured out, is because like if you go to certain places, um, it does load the game, which is unfortunate. But uh, we could try something like that. I mean, we did it for Salt and Sanctuary, so I mean, I can do it for. We can do it for Dark Souls, I'm sure. It'd be tricky though. I'd have to get really good. <laughs> I have to get really good at that. I've kind of contemplated at this point, and it'll maybe like in a month or two or something. I don't know. I have to think about it a little harder. But I have kind of contemplated allowing viewers because a couple I've gotten asked a couple times now if viewers can pay to have me do a run. And I've, I've a couple of streamers I watch like to do that as well, where like you know either a, either a group of viewers or just one viewer in particular will just pay for a run to have it like happen something I wouldn't normally do you know um, which I'm kind of open to the idea although there would be a couple stipulations to that of course like I don't maybe it's like I only have to stream it for a certain number of hours as opposed to like actually completing the run that kind of thing so but we'll see and that sounds like a kind of run that I would probably not do you know like I don't think I'd ever really want to just <laughs> just do that for fun but i could see myself doing it if like you know if chat really wanted it so but we'll worry about that later i'll think that over and we'll worry about that later doing dark souls 2 because after a while they don't respawn oh god yeah that's after 12 times though that would take forever just got here what's up hey you're a little late but uh we're doing good we're just kind of uh, running around we're about to go uh I don't know how to say this without it sounding sexual, so I just won't. But we're about to take this weapon and go fight the next boss, if you if you catch my drift. So, anyway. Things are going good, though. Glad you made it. Get you out of the way. Come on, boys. Oh, wow, you can actually make it in here. I did not know you could do that. One mouse. Whoa. Okay, let's get that trickier. Oh, ha, hello. Come on, second mouse. No? Yeah, that's what I thought. Ow. Oh, boy. Okay. Will I farm drinks? No. No, we've done enough farming this run. We don't need to do any more. Plus, your weapons are fine. Ow. Ow. Quit it. There we go. Oh, I apparently had a mouse on my hand. Cool. Let's see if we can lure him around the corner here. And if you could just unbuff, that'd be really helpful. Alright. Alright, well, this is gonna end badly. Okay, there's the buff. Ow. Ow. No. Oh, what? Okay. Okay. Ah, well. Ugh. God. The chat makes it sexual. I know. <laughs> hey, you did it, not me. You did it, not me. Man, these, this ring really does work pretty good as far as sneaking around is concerned. I keep going down here like I have the shortcut unlocked, and I do not have that unlocked. Alright. One of the cheese demons coming? I don't think they're going to make it this stream. I have a lot of video editing to do for this weekend's video, so I think 
we're gonna finish this boss off and then that'll probably be it for this run for now at least until I make a video out of it get you out of the way rat feet do look like human hands you're absolutely correct yes it's the that and the tails are like the one things I can or the couple things I can understand people don't like rats about but like pet rats are dope though so like you know not gonna <laughs> be careful who you say that to yeah <laughs> if you can't if you don't have the ability to get a dog oh come on now uh, if you don't have the like the means to get a dog because either like you just don't have time to walk a dog or uh, like your apartment won't allow it get a rat you can teach them all sorts of really cool tricks. And they're loyal. Which is nice. Alright, screw it. Let's just go for it. Or get a cat. A.K.A. a roommate. Yeah. <laughs> if you just want a fluffy animal around, get a cat. If you want uh, an animal that kind of like relies on you and wants to bond with you, get a rat or dog. And I know I say that kind of jokingly, like, because there's plenty of really loving cats out there. But a majority of cats just don't care. Like, it's been scientifically proven that they don't even care about other cats. So, <laughs> you know. If they don't care about cats, what do they think about us? You gotta wonder. Eh. Run away! Okay. Get a fluffy bird, they bite though. Yeah, that's the problem. With, I don't. Birds don't really have a sense of loyalty, and they do bite. So, not a huge fan of birds. They're fine though. I like them when they're outside. Your cat plays fetch better than your dog does. Well, <laughs> sounds like you're not motivating that dog. Have you tried introducing a treat to the equation? Because after that, I tell you, a dog will do anything. If you want both, get a raccoon. <laughs> yeah, it's got little human hands, but it also, like, does whatever. No, oh, God. Alright. Let's get this party started, huh? I'll change up the music real quick. Because I know this one's kind of long. Not that one. <laughs> Actually, no, that, that's perfect. Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> Alright, button masher, count us in. Come on, baby. Let's see what we're looking at. Eh. Alright, I can work that damage. Run away! I was hope. Oh god! I was hoping having the ring out would keep the uh, sorcerer from trying to jump in, but uh, looks like that's a no dice on that one. Good damage though. I can work with that. Ow! Would you quit? I <laughs> the opposite of what I said. How far in can he shoot? Good lord. There we go. There we go. All right. Okay. What? <laughs> Oy. This music goes off. Yeah, right? Definitely my favorite Pokemon remix, for sure. Button Mesher did a fantastic job with it. Mega Punch! <laughs> go, Lemon! I choose you! Alrighty. <laughs> Your rat became a warlock. <laughs> yeah, you gotta watch out for that. You gotta be careful of that, you know? Oh, what? Okay. I have a... I have a thing. I'm fine. I have just one of these. We're fine. Iron Pineapple has got aim. <laughs> he does, doesn't he? It's all those eyes. Man's got six or eight eyes. I can't remember how many, but, uh... But, yeah. 
There's only one rat I know, and that one knows how to cook. I love ratatouille. It's a shame he had to hide under a hat the whole time and not get just, you know, the credit he was due, but, uh, you know. The things we do for the things we love. Alright, Fist, I'm gonna need you to work with me a little bit more here. Just kind of give me a little bit more range. Mm, what, um... What, what was that? <laughs> Crap. Oh, boy. Tony only run. If someone can, if someone can mess with mods enough to make it so that everyone is Tony, I mean we've already got the uh, the bone wheel run. But uh, if you want to mess with it a little more, a little more, and start doing things like that, you go for it. That might be one of those paid runs. <laughs> Chat's gonna have to come together on that one. I wonder, does YouTube? No, YouTube doesn't have a thing where it shows like donations going towards something. But I think Streamlabs does. I might be able to make something like that happen. We'll see. Like I said, give me some time to think about it. And uh, we'll, we'll go from there. We'll go from there. Boop, that snoop. <laughs> One dollar, take it or leave it. <laughs> you drive a hard bargain there. I'm not gonna lie, it's very tempting. Pretty sure it's a coco. <laughs> No, it's Ratatouille. It's Ratatouille. Get your mind. Get your mind straight. Oh, good, he's buffed now. Okay, that'll... That'll be helpful. Yes, thank you, Iron Pineapple. Doing's God, doing God's work up there. Much appreciated. All right, you know, the compliment was enough. You didn't have to contribute. Ah! You can do it. Come on. There you go, Lemon. Run away. All right. Touch that. Punch him in the. Punch him in the cankle. Give me the old one-two punch. Except it's more of like a one-one-one-one punch, but that's okay. All right. Ow! Big bully. Oh come on now. Oh, this is a this is a bad this is a bad fight to have a buff on. That's for sure. Go for the tail. Mm. <laughs> Let's see. There is a chat mod Ludwig's dev is working on to improve YouTube chat. You should check it out. Hmm. Is he sharing that or is it something that he's just kind of uh I mean, I know obviously he's making it for himself, but uh I mean, if he shares that with the community, that'd be that'd be awesome. I would be more than happy to uh, boost YouTube chat into the realm of uh, Twitch chat, for sure. I want to kill the wizard. We're, sh we're kind of struggling on that aspect, because I'd have to go back, and also there's a bunch of rats that keep getting in the way. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, we're, we're, we're fine. Everything's fine. Don't worry about it. Recover the zero souls? <laughs> no! <laughs> That's a wasted click. We must be as efficient as possible by doing the same thing over and over again. <laughs> oh god. Demon King, my man, just just go to bed. It's okay. There's only gonna be about like this is the last boss fight we're doing, so if if you don't see it, it's okay, you can come back, skip to the end of the video. I keep all the live VODs on the channel, so you'll be fine. And just come back and see how it ended. Sleep is important. You need it. Sleep is for the banana? <laughs> banana. She sleep. Alright. Kind of kind of missing the range here, but uh, we're going to get it. We're going to get it. Okay. Well, that's, that's fair. Okay. Punch you in the... Punch you in the who's it's Am I dead again? Yeah, I'm dead again. Oh, God. What's this song? This song is, uh, Vapor Trail. Uh, the staff credits. 
It's an old Sega Genesis game. Don't VADs ruin engagement? Uh, not to my knowledge, no. We seem to be having plenty of engagement, if I'm being honest. And if they do, eh, whatever. If they do, whatever. People can't all make the stream, I know. My streaming schedule is, uh, kinda bonkers, considering I have to stream at certain hours of the day. I know a lot of people can't make it. Um, and a lot of people do watch the stream afterwards, so I would be, uh, doing my community a disservice if I took that away. Kurosaki, welcome back. Six months, man. I just woke up for the end, but hello everyone. How are we doing this fine day? Oh, we're doing just fine. Yeah, I hate to say it, you did wake up for the end, but, uh, you know, it's okay. The VOD will be there. You'll still see everything else. Thanks for rejoining, by the way. YouTube loves the community. Yeah, they... They something. They something. I don't know. I think... I think that YouTube is slowly kind of fixing a lot of the problems. I mean, there's... Don't get me wrong. There's plenty of decisions that are more business-related than community-related. Which, uh, at the current time, makes sense. But if they have some str like some strong competition from other companies, like Twitch and them, that should fix that problem, because they won't be able to do that if they don't have a monopoly. The only problem is Twitch is not doing a very good job of being competitive, so we're kind of in that fun... Okay, uh... <laughs> I got stomped and sniped, good lord. Uh, we're kind of in that fun time period where YouTube is kind of allowed to do what they want to do, and there's not much we can do about it right now. But, such as it is. Some say Twitch is on the way out. Yeah, yeah, I think they're, uh, they're definitely struggle bussing for sure. There's a lot of decisions being made that kind of imply that they're hurting. Um, yeah, yeah. More information needed, but uh, it's not looking good. There's a reason we're not on Twitch, that's for sure. Eh. There we go. Alrighty. I have to tell to try this in Dark Souls 3. <laughs> well, let's, let's get through one game at a time, huh? One game at a time. All right, you. You were supposed to be easy. <laughs> you were supposed to be the easy one. Why are you difficult? I mean, I know why he's difficult. It's because I'm goofing and I'm not, uh... Oh, good, he's buffed now. Okay, cool. Yeah, that'll go well with that hit. I took the words right out of my mouth there, bud. <laughs> oh, God. You would give your soul for a lemon plushie? Um, I mean, you realize that's just like the elite knight, right? <laughs> oh god. Alright, one more attempt. One more attempt. We'll give it our all. Yeah, I, uh, I would love to add my, like, lemon character to a bunch of stuff. My only problem with that is I'm kinda worried, and I have to do a lot of reading, or legal reading, on uh, the legality of being allowed to use the image. I'm sure if I make it cartoony, which, you know, like I do already, that it's perfectly fine. But we gotta be careful if we if I sell it, you know? So. Iron Golem Fist. Yeah, buddy. Best weapon. Don't let anyone tell you otherwise. <laughs> Keep running into the concrete wall. Uh, you know, it has to break down eventually, right? The human body regenerates. Brick walls do not. Go kill the sorcerer. Now! Can't make me. Don't wanna. Alright, let's try this again. Come on now. Caleb! <laughs> Just got a shirt. My man! <laughs> Thank you so much. I appreciate you. Hope you enjoy it. Okay, alright, okay. 
<laughs> All right, that doesn't count. <laughs> that was the game's fault. They just the camera on the corner just kind of shoved us there. Let's try that again. Uh, but yeah, no, really appreciate you getting that shirt. And anyone else, again, final call. Final call. Get them while they're good. If you haven't gotten a shirt yet, now is the time. By the end of today, the campaign will be over. And then they're gone. Alright, we got our mid-roll. I got a skirt on. We're gonna work. <laughs> this isn't working. Go for the channel. Ye of little faith! <laughs> no, you're, you're absolutely right, and in any other run I would. But considering we're kind of finishing the stream, it's whatever. It's whatever. It's fine. <laughs> Yo, Dragon, you still counting? <laughs> He's always counting. <laughs> Man never stops. Oh, God. All right. What if I... Oh, I was going to say, what if I two-hand it? And the answer is, you cannot. Darn. That's kind of weird. You can two-hand the Cestus. Huh, weird. Anyway. Where's the buff on the feet? That is the slumbering dragon ring. Uh, it makes me walk real quiet. <laughs> Which doesn't really help, but, you know, it's it's fun. Oh, here he comes. Okay. Give me that, give me that fist of yours. Mano y mano, let's do it. Well, well, okay. Change your mind, I guess. Okay, run away. There we go. Get that back foot. There we go. Get a little side swipe. There we are. Tail coming. Oh, nope, that was a fist. That's okay. Okay. One, two. Okay. Run swipe. Two. Something happened. I don't know what move that was, but I don't care. Let's get away from that. Heal up. Iron Pineapple's finally given me a break. What a chad. Oh, he's going for it. Okay. See, even the gaping dragon knows that sometimes you just gotta run into a wall repeatedly. He knows. He gets it. What am I swinging at here? <laughs> Knocking out a tooth. Oh! Okay. Well, I thought that was a tail swing. We got this. We're fine. Ugh. Love the camera. Ah! Oh. Uh-oh. Well, you know, this thing has, like, freaking unlimited durability. We're fine. Oh, that hurts me, though? Oh, damn. Okay. <laughs> nope. A nice try. Scoot over, because somehow he manages to hit you on the other side. Almost there. Almost there. Ooh. Okay. I saw that coming and I did nothing to stop it. <laughs> Almost there. Wait for the screaming. Yep, there it goes. Alrighty. Good solid number of swings on here. I'm just going for that again. Give him some room. Somebody hold that man's hair back. Eh. Eh. Scoot over. Okay. Oh, we got the buff going. Oh, boy. Right, pineapple's had enough of my shit. Oh, pineapple, come on. Give it to me, man. Come on. <laughs> Just <laughs> be chill. Oh, he's doing that again? Alright, whatever. Take advantage. This might hurt. This might hurt a little. 
Uh, yeah, just a little bit. All right, who died? <laughs> Something just gave me eleven thousand or 1,100 souls. That was weird. Uh-oh. Okay. Put your, put your right in the mouth. There it is. Hatuken! Yeah! <laughs> Nailed it. Nailed it. And you all were worried. All right. Ah, ladies and gentlemen, it's been fun. It's been fun. Thanks to everybody who did some donations and everyone that joined up with the memberships. Really appreciate all of you. Everyone who's been buying a shirt quietly in the background, I appreciate you as well. Seriously, could not do what I do without you. Tony agrees. And uh, yeah, really appreciate everything that you guys do. Really appreciate everyone that just came out to watch. I hope you all had a good time. Until then, I need to get back to work. I need to get to work on some videos and some other things and eat lunch. But uh, we'll, uh, we'll see you all again soon, I guarantee it. Uh, next stream when? Well, like I said, I'd love to actually have a stream schedule. I really would. At the current time, I'll have to talk it over with Mrs. Lemon and see if there's any days that work best. But at the current time, I just don't have a day that works consistently. So uh, just keep an eye out on the channel. I always post uh, 24 hours beforehand whenever I'm about to do a live stream. So uh, just keep it out for that. Or join the Discord. I post uh, updates there too. Until then, everybody, be good to one another. Stay safe. Have yourselves a good day. Bye-bye.